Disclaimer. This video's information is being provided for informational, educational, and general interest purposes only. The information in this video is not intended to shock, enrage, or otherwise provoke the viewer. The sole purpose of this video was to raise awareness of true crime-related events. Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976, allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, scholarship, and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. Nonprofit, educational or personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal... One moment. One moment. For collect call press 1. For Please dial 0. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $35.60. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? What's the door? I think you might have lost service. Yeah, it's that internet connection off. I said internet connection lost and we're driving on the road, so if we lose it again. Uh, who was driving, you or mom? Father. Oh. Ask her if she talked to Henry today. Holy fucking shit, that's a lot of water there. No. Mm-hmm. Hopefully we can get that through when we come back. You said what? Oh, the water fucking was boiling over a tree, so I said hopefully that we can go back through this way. Yeah? Otherwise, huh. we'll just go a long way around. Yeah. What time is it? Honey? Huh? It's 3.30, it's going to be 3.30 here in a little while. So it's 4.30 here? Uh, it's like literally quarter after, I guess, so. Quarter after? On the phone, on the car, it's 320. I think I'm going to lose you here again. Yeah, so I'll let you go. I'll call you all later tonight, okay? A few hours, two, three hours. Okay. All right, love y'all. Love y'all. I'll do it. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. <laughs> one moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Plus. <laughs> Hello, this is a collect call from... An inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $30. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new affordable per minute rates, press 2 to accept this call. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello. 
So. Yeah, you said you left him a message. Yeah. I guess we'll call. So I just called him and left a message. Okay. Try to call him like another before you leave for work again too. You um have any luck googling lawyers or anything like that? Looking up lawyers. I not yet. We went fishing last night. We didn't get home till almost nine, and I went right to bed. I was tired. Well, because my lawyer said he's going to see me sometime before the Thursday, so it's either today or tomorrow, so I'm going to see what he has to say about this fucking program shit, but if they're trying to say that I'm worse off than Jenny, then that don't make no fucking sense, but, like, I don't know if they offer me a program or not. Being that she fucking is pleading out to go to prison, which is fucking stupid. No, no. We'll wait and see what he comes up with first, and then we'll go from there. Yeah, that's what I said. Hopefully, he'll come see me today, but like I said, I want to at least get them the, that call that number again and have to see if they can come and uh, evaluate me and see if they think they can get me a program. So I know my lawyer said he's going to see <laughs> if he can get the court to approve somebody to come out and evaluate me or whatever. So, I don't know. Did uh, James or Greg ever get a hold of him? Not that I know of. It's this Monday. I'd, I'd call him again and shit. I figured he'd, he'd have talked to him by now. Right. That's what I'm saying. I don't know what, what this man is doing, but I need, this is my life. I need I need out. <laughs> oh. Stop him playing around and doing whatever the fuck, but I'm still stuck in here, like, what the fuck? I don't know. Yeah, like I said, hopefully, hopefully you can get a hold of somebody before you go to work and see what they say. You know, actually talk to somebody. Right. I sent the, that number to my lawyer, too. I'm like, I don't know if, uh, I'm like, I don't know if I should have you call him or my mom call him, but I gave him the number, so. Yeah. No. Well, what time was it there? I don't even know what time it is. Almost Five, eight. Almost eight there? Yeah. What time is it? What the fuck? I thought it was almost 7 Huh? It's only 8.50 then? Okay. It's 7.50? Yeah, so it's only 8.50 here. I fell asleep. I thought it was 9.50. That's crazy. Hmm. 7.55. Yeah, I was trying to wait up after I stayed up after breakfast. After I got in the shower and started reading. And I fell asleep, and I'm like, I'll, I just woke up, like, I'll stop. Woke up. I uh, feel like I'm spark. The last two days, I feel like I'm spark. I was camping, was fine. Yeah. Did y'all sleep in tents? No, we might as well. The fucking mattresses in those cabins were, like, sleeping on a rock. To Y'all sold your damn, uh, trailer, huh? Your, uh, fucking, what do you call it? Yeah. I wish you guys would've kept it. I could've damn, I could've slept in this motherfucker. <laughs> uh, your camper or whatever. I could've lived in your damn camper. Yeah. I said I wish yeah. you guys would've kept your camper. I could've lived in your camper. Yeah, I heard you. Yeah. Um, um, well, I don't know. Well, try to try to call him again before he had to work, and let me know if you get through to him or not, or whatever. And we'll have to call you back. Right. Want to find out? We'll eat some crackers or something. Okay. All right. I'll love you. Love you too. Huh? All right. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. For calling card call. Please dial 0. Plus.
Hello, this is a free call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello. Hello. Sorry, I missed the first time. I couldn't get to it quick enough. I was on the other side of the... I was in the living room and I was out in the kitchen. By the time I got to it, it just hung up. I'm like, fuck. You doing this? Mm -hmm. Unloading Larry's lunchbox. You doing what? Unloading his lunchbox so I can pack a different lunch. Oh, well, there you go. I just went down to the trap house to help unload uh, birds. Because yeah. Lennon and Jim got back from get, picking a ton of them up. So she didn't say nothing about, the, um, about the freezer yet? About what? She didn't say nothing about the freezer yet? No, it's weird. I haven't talked to her. I haven't heard her since that night that she was texting me about it. Oh. And I texted her back and I haven't heard from her since. I'm like, what the fuck? Mm. I'll probably see her next Next Saturday, hmm. the fourth, she's having Aubrey's birthday at her mom's. Hmm. What's Lizzie what doing? I'm loading birds down at the trap house. Daddy's gonna come home and cook. Daddy's gonna come home and cook some chip, chicken breast wrapped in bacon on the grill. What's the nice? So what we had for dinner? Fucking so sandwich. No, I don't know what's going on mm -hmm. in the kitchen, but they brought us a damn sack lunch. The lunch sandwich and the apple and fucking bacon. Okay. I'm like, what the fuck? Mm -hmm. The one time yeah, I was cool, you're not here, I guess. Like, mm -hmm. You know, I was like, I'm starving. I'm, I'm ready to eat dinner. Wait for them to bring the trays in. And here comes fucking sack lunch. I'm like, oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Like the they knew. They knew. They knew the trays were no good. Not to eat it, so they brought me a sandwich. And the cheese is fake <laughs> because it doesn't even be. It's like plastic. <laughs> oh lord. Where the fuck did they get the cheese? I don't know. But you know it's fake when it doesn't like melt. They try to put it on a burger with I mean it, I don't know, it just doesn't melt horribly. Mm. Well. Yeah, somebody said that the new Oscar is going to be out the 28th, so... Which is what, Monday? Mm -hmm. Keep looking. Hopefully it ain't too much. It's probably $50. That's why I was hoping Heather would have bought that freezer. And then he could just use $100 to get me, in, me an L1. You talked to L today? Yeah, he messaged me. Oh, I got it when I got home. I didn't have any internet at work today, so I couldn't check. It wouldn't let me go on here and check anything. So I was like, what the fuck? Uh, what was he doing? <laughs> I don't know. I just said, let me get to it. He's like, I asked for the books, and they said that they have them. Thank you for letting me know. Please let her know I love her, miss her. How is your day good, I hope? Wait, he said what about the book? He said he asked. Oh, okay. Well, I'll give to him. Because the CEO was trying to um, put a, the, the the last ones in my property, number seven and eight. I was like, no, they go to the, the temple center because he's holding on to them or whatever. She said, well, I'll put them in your property. I'm like, no, they don't go in my property. Uh-huh. <laughs> So, I mean, if they do put them on properties, I can just have Templeton get them out and give them to Al, but whatever. And then when Al's done with them, put them back in your property. That way, then you can bring them home. Well, yeah, that's what they said. I said, if, even if they uh, donated to jail, I don't really care because they're, they're like, they're shitty <laughs> quality. I don't know. I want to get the real hardcover ones, the real collection ones, because these ones, it looks like someone took the page ripped it in half and then taped it back together on some of the pages, a couple of pages. And then some of the couple oh, of pages were, it was so faded you could barely read it. I mean, they were good, huh. I read it all. 
No problem. I read, read through it. There's a shitty quality. Oh, the back God, of it is it. peeling off. Like, the cover is peeling off. Like, it's like a sticker. I mean, like I said, they're shitty quality. I want to get the real hardcover collection. Because if you look at right. the back of it, it's, there's three other books uh, that goes with it that I want to get, too. The Magical yeah. Beast, Where to Find Them, and Beatles of the Bard. Yeah, there's, there's other books that go with it that I want to get, too. Hmm. Like I said, I want to get the actual real, real books. So, eventually. Yeah. I don't know. I kind of like reading. I've been reading a lot lately. I'm reading a really good book right now. Jenny would like it. No. Horses. I got your, got your letter today. Oh, you did? Yeah. Did I'll get Larry Larry's it? card when he... No, not yet. Oh. Um, I opened it after he left because I was busy. Oh. So, I'll give it to him when he gets here. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. What is it? Hopefully my lawyer, my new lawyer will come to me, so hopefully, uh, I guess I got plenty of time. I don't go to court for a few months, so. Right. Yeah. Well, maybe so he'll get you, things set up. That's what, well, probably not, but it's just fine, because it, it'll give me enough time to get caught up with the case. Mm. But, um, so when do you pay him? Like, what? Since it's once a month, you are, did you already pay him? You paid him in five months. Him. Well, like, what, did you agree upon a date, or? No, just once a month, whatever we spent, whenever we get it to him. So oh. I'll, I'll keep 150 out of this one, and then 150 out of my next one, and then send it. He'll probably get it in the middle. Oh, okay. Like, so you just send him a check or something? Yeah, I'll just give Larry the money, and he can write out a check. Oh, so Larry, you tell Larry that you can go 500 then? Yeah. I mean, it'll still be paid them. off in, in, what, 10 months? But I'm, I'm hoping, do you any, no other word on the stimulus check? No. Damn, because I was hoping to uh, put some money on my books and shit, money on the books. Get low. I, mm -hmm. wanted, uh, I guess they're I'm supposed to be sending people, if it does go through, they're just going to be sending people debit cards or whatever. So oh, they say they're not to throw them away. Huh? They're sending people debit cards? Oh, well, my, it, mine would probably go on my, my debit card, card, right? I don't know if it'll do that or if it'll just go on but it, the you, card. But did it get approved? Not yet. Oh, damn. Well, keep an eye out because that's like I said, I want to uh, use some money. <laughs> well, did can't it we all. The, so that card... It, that didn't work with the first did it? No, it didn't work for any of the iCares. Just the books, huh? Yeah. Oh. Well, I mean, that ain't too bad, but... Yeah, they cut back down on the first service, too. They're only doing run on, uh, on Thursdays now. So they get someone hired. <laughs> but someone... There was a new guy tonight, so... Hopefully, we'll have some help. Right. How come when you sent the cheeseburger, it was over $20? Is it because it came with wings or something? Yeah, well, yeah. You got a burger, it was only $13. Yeah, the bur just, the plant just the burgers are cheaper. Oh. If you get the wings with it, it's like 18 something But then if you get, then you got your, your handling fee is like six, almost seven bucks. <laughs> a handling fee? And it comes yeah, cold? Yeah, that's what the we find out. Yeah. That's dumb as fuck. <laughs> and they come through it from the building. Right. Handling feet. But they just got here fucking after dinner tonight. Usually they're around 1 o'clock. They didn't even come till almost 5. It was came at 5 o'clock tonight. <laughs> I'm sure. And it hurt his pizza look burnt. And I'm sure it was cold. So a handling feet is pretty retarded. Yeah. Maybe you should say something next time they deliver it. Say, you guys start six ninety five for a handling fee? Huh. All right, that was dumb as hell. So I didn't know that. That's why I said yeah. you should um allow us to buy our own because usually you can. You can order your own fresh favorite on commentary for Thursdays, but they took them off because the Corona. So that's why I was like, Dave, are we gonna be able to order our own soon? Because it's only like seven dollars. Mm -hmm. 
or it's only five ninety five for a burger. No, I'm not and, and then the, they have a special that changes every week, like pizza or whatever. Then it's, it's only like eight dollars. Well, you know what mm-hmm. cheaper that would be. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, are they talking about doing the same amount for the stimulus check? No, I think it was 2000 for up to a year, a month. See, that, that would be nice, because I could fucking use the money. Yeah. I could back them up. But yeah, that's why it's taking this one so much longer to go through, because it's so much, you know. So, yeah, they probably they probably might send everybody a new debit card. Well, if that's the case, let me know when I get it so I can get the money on our books and then pay later a bit. So, did they put a yeah. show to my thing? Not the one next one thing. No. Yeah, because, I mean, if they do it in a month for a year, that's $24,000. Yeah. That's nice. Um, I, think, I think Mary, Mary couple is supposed to be 4000 yeah, I would assume two thousand each person. So damn. So that means um, I wonder what's where's the house? Did he? I wonder if they're they're not his to my house. Like, should have you change his address to your house? Because then he can use his own money. Yeah, I don't know. So he didn't do his taxes or nothing. No. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. But if they send him a debt, I don't know. It's fucking crazy. Mm. Mm. Well, Papa, yeah, I said hello. All right. Uh, yeah, so keep me updated on that damn stimulus check, guys. I'm waiting. I said, uh, Cutting back on what I order or whatever, so I ain't got much left, but right now the stimulus shit. Yeah, let me know, like I said, if Heather's gonna get that or not. I guess I've got till Sunday, so don't come out till Sunday, but. Let's try to go. Talk to Jenny? Not yet. She'll probably call and soon. She's still in uh, the two man. Yeah, as far as I know. When you talk to L again, tell him I sent him like three letters this week. I think I sent one like every day. Right. But, uh. <coughs> so is she by herself still? Or does she got a roommate? I don't know, she's got another roommate, but I don't know who it is. She said she heard him over talk or over talking or whatever that her roommate hates her and she doesn't she wants to be moved she doesn't want to be with a baby killer I don't know yeah she needs to tell the CEO then you know mm-hmm. tell her to tell the CEO she they won't do nothing deal. about it um uh, tell her kite class missions let her know let her know the pro- it's the problem no, she didn't say it to her face, but she just said it behind her back. Yeah, on the phone or something, probably. Tell Jenny to get on the kiosk or whatever and try to call the Tell them that she's calling, calling her names and they're not getting along. No. No? I wonder who it is. Oh. I don't know. That's because they are still playing it on there. Like, it's crazy. You saw the news the other day. Yeah. And, and, and Jenny's the one that, that keeps making it happen. I'm mean, putting it on the news by all her lies. She's making it work. You're right. So. I don't. She can't get nothing through her head. So, whatever. So, she, she deserves all her lies. It just, people are coming up to me, they're like, do you know what your sister's saying about you? I'm like, I can only imagine. I've heard people say this before. No. She's like, if, uh, she's like, if, if, if they believe all the shit she's saying, you're never going to see the light of day again. I'm like, oh, I believe it. 
But I just hope that she gets caught in her own fucking lies. Right. They fucking believe the shit she says, and that's not fair on me. And if I go to fucking prison, I'm mad as fuck. You can't help? No. Fucking bullshit. I'm saying, if she thinks she knows what she's doing, she out. I don't know. <sighs> Can't wait to get out of here. <laughs> no. So, Larry, when I get out, he's going to take, take me carp shooting. I want to go carp shooting. No. <laughs> you, you ever been carp shooting? No more this year. No. Well, maybe we can go together then. Maybe. Okay. I want to shoot a fish with a bow and arrow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. mm-hmm. yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I'm fucking sick of noodles. I'm starving. I'm going to make me damn noodles. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hopefully I go to the dentist tomorrow. I thought I was going to go last Friday, but I didn't. Oh, you're getting our tooth pulled or what? Yeah. I put it in a couple weeks ago to go see but I thought I was going to go Friday, but I didn't. So I'll probably go tomorrow. Mm-hmm. I didn't go last week. I was. I'll probably go tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know. You know, if I start never call him, but he's never home when I call. Right. I never know when he's going to be home when he ain't, so. Alright. Well, he's never home. Right. He's always doing something. Now he's going to make his own bullets and all that. No, I don't think so. I don't know. I know he still got all the stuff, but I don't know if he mm-hmm. ever has time to do it. I don't know. I'm going to say that, but he probably don't even have no time. You know, right? Yeah. Well, let's go. I don't I think the time is about to be up any minute now anyway. But, uh, like I said, hopefully Heather will be back to you. I don't know. No messenger are again. We, are they that. talking about knowing any time soon about the thing we're checking out or no? No, it doesn't say. That's good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, well, let's go. And if I hear anything, I'll let you know. All right, like I said, just let all know I'm, I'm cool and just mess them and that uh, I sent them a few letters and a couple pictures. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Love you too. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. One moment. One moment. For collect call. Please dial zero. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $22.68. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? 
So the video chat works then? Well, kind of. She was too short. So tomorrow, I set one up for tomorrow morning, so she's going to stand on some books. <laughs> oh, they don't have a chair in there? Apparently not. <laughs> Good God. Um, did you set up L too? Yeah, I'm hoping we can do them both, because I did them both with mine. So I think I could go on one of my devices and go into his account and get it set, you know what I mean, get it ready, and then use my other. Tomorrow at 1130? Huh? Is it set for tomorrow at 1130 like mine, right? Yeah, they're both at 1130. Okay, well, because I was in the middle of typing a message to him, but I paused it so I could call you, so I could let him know that it's tomorrow at 1130. You're like all staticky, I can't understand you. Probably this fucking phone, they're shitty. Is that better? No, not really. I don't know, it's a fucking phone. Well, fuck, it could be the fan, too, I don't know. God, it sucks. What you doing? Oh, I'm just cleaning and doing laundry. Mm. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out why the fuck they moved me up here the second floor. I don't know if they'll move me back or not. I'm trying to get back down there. Like it down yeah. there. So it's fucking hot up here. That's what he said. I just woke up about 1230. Stephanie wrote back yet? No. She usually doesn't go on the kiosk till after dinner anyway. She might wake up. Or around close to 2.30, 2.30 to check it, but... Yeah. I got my other two books today. I just got my third and fourth one. The fourth one's thick as fuck. <laughs> I'm very... Well, did you read the fourth one before you did the third one? Huh? How do you know the fourth one sucks? You don't read that before you read the third one. No, I got number three and number four. I can have two books at a time. Yeah, you got three and four. You said four is retarded. No, I said four is thick. Big. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yep. All right. Well, I'm going to let you go, but I'm going to finish writing this message quick. Send him, and then we'll go sit down and read it. I guess there ain't nothing else to do. <laughs> what is, oh, don't forget tomorrow to go on there and try to send that I care. See if it's on there that this morning, that uh, new one. Yeah, for some reason it won't let me do it on my phone anymore, but it comes up on the iPad or the my tablet, so I can do it on there. Oh, okay. Yeah, don't forget, tomorrow morning it should be re available. Yeah. I'll let you. I'll call you later. Yeah, I love you. Okay. You're going to call me, what? well, I'll talk to you, what, tomorrow at 11.30 then? Uh, I'll call you tomorrow before 11.30 to make sure you're ready and everything. Oh, it sends me a text. Does it? Okay. Yeah, it says you gotta, I'll you gotta get 15 minutes. I'll be on there about five minutes beforehand, so just make sure you click ready or whatever. But I'll be on there about five yeah. minutes beforehand, so. Yeah, I saw it. Alright, well, I'll let you. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Alright, bye. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal... <laughs> One moment. One moment. For collect call. Please dial zero. Plus... <laughs> Hello, this is a free call from... Mm. An inmate at... Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by PayPal Communications. Para Español Presiones 2. We're going to go to the wrong side. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? 
Hello. Hi. Well, yeah. Hi. Hi. You sound, I can actually hear you today. You must not be high today. Yeah. 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 Hmm. I don't know. I've been feeling that well all day today, for real. Oh, well, there you go with the mumbling again. I said I haven't been feeling that well all day today. I've been nervous today. Why? Well, I had, like, three weird dreams. And then mom... Tell me? Yes. And then my mom texted me and said that my Facebook is... She reactivated my Facebook. Oh, yeah. So I'm that. You, you need to hurry up and get, get on there and do what you have to do, because I'm nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous about having it reactivated. Yeah, she said, um... So let her know when I was going to be activated again. Yeah, just... Get what I don't know what pictures you can pull to pull apart. Just take whatever pictures you like, and then tell her okay. to get the activator of her. But there's a lot okay. of pictures on there, so... Okay. You want to tell them, if you, or you an owl, or a big boy, what do you want here? Whatever you want. I don't want none of me okay. to help. I, just, I don't want her to feel me. I don't want to be upset. No, I don't, I don't want any of me to help. I don't have none. Okay. I just, just take whatever you want. Okay. Okay. Mom said that you're supposed to send her. I know it. You're supposed to send her a collage, but I told her I didn't like the ones that you made because I didn't like those photos. I'll make a new one. She's like, why? I'm What's wrong with the photos? I said, I just don't like them. I don't like my picture taken. I said, you could have sent her better ones. Well, I'll, put, I'll just, um, I'll get them and I'll make some new ones and send them to your mom. Yeah. Um, yeah, I had, the first dream I had last night was really weird. It, it, it was, um, was it? Like I, it was a sex dream, wasn't it? They, that they called me down for pre-trial, but I denied it. You were mad at me. Why? You're like, why did you deny for trial? You could have Fuck yeah, I'm mad. I'm, this is my dream. Like, I know, I'm saying, fuck yeah, I'd be mad. Yeah, you were like yelling at me, like, why did you deny it? You could have got out of house arrest, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, they were never going to let me out of house arrest. Right. Mm -hmm. That must have been it. It must have woke up because that's all I remember. And then my second dream, because I was just like all day, just woke up. My second dream was fucking weird. I had a dream that day. What is in a big pod, like, uh, like West One One almost, but it was three bunks high? Yeah. And they put me and you in there, like, I was in the middle and you were up top. And then, oh, yeah, out, of nowhere, out of nowhere, they brought in the men. And L came over. The men? Yeah, they brought us the men. And then L came over and he was on the bottom. So it was L that me and you. And then. Oh, wow, that's them. So I didn't know what to do. So I, I get out of bed and then L and I start doing stuff. In my mm -hmm. room, and then... Ooh, sex dream! And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, Miss Thomas comes in and starts Here yelling at us. Here comes me! Miss Thomas started yelling at us, and she took him out in the hallway and was yelling at him, and I was yelling at her to stop yelling at him. Uh-uh. I'm like, you guys, it's your fault. You set us up. You put us together and blah, blah, blah. And right. And you were just laying on the bus like, she was watching. It was weird. Not <laughs> what? Yeah. Hey, did you ever, do you know, um, that, have you ever read, like, a dream interpret, interpreter book? If I what? Have you ever read, like, a dream interpreter book? Like, um, you know, like, you read what your dreams are about? Like, different things symbolize different things in your dreams? Mm, no. I don't know. Like, different know. animals and, like, different, uh, um, yeah, objects. Like, I'm going to have to even have him around to them. Like, if you dream about... Black hair or something, and he's gas or something, and a snake, and he's gas. I don't know. Um, I don't really believe yeah. in that, but because I've been well, I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm gonna send one in. Are you gonna read it? You're gonna what? I'm gonna send one in. I can't hear you. So I'm gonna send one in. Send one in. A book, a dream book. Oh, oh, you're gonna send me a dream book? Yeah. Uh, gotta be what other kind of books do you want? Because, um, me and Zach's about to get his money tomorrow, so... I don't want any books. I don't even read the book I'm reading now. Oh, what about but some really hard to do go? No, they, they, they don't allow those. They don't allow those books. That's I just dumb. sleep all day. I'm telling you, I just... I'm trying to think of how to say it. You can't sleep all day. I get slapped and I sleep all day. Put <laughs> it that way. Um... Did you guys make cheesecake last night? Did. Oh, was it good? 
Oh, that was great. That's going to be so good. I haven't eaten yet. I haven't eaten all day. Yeah. I'm too depressed. I'm so bored. I can't wake up here. Like, I wake up and I'm just more depressed. And I just go back to sleep. And I just just repeat all the time. That's not good for you. Like, I I legit just woke up. It was quiet all day. Plus, our fan got... They shut our TV fan off earlier, but not the phone. Why? What? And who's the CEO? It was Rota for today. That's why it was so quiet. Oh, yeah, that's why. Uh, yeah, you can't be in a class. We got court coming up, dude. Huh? Yeah, you can't be all depressed and funked out. We got court coming up. That's probably why. Like, I'm just... We got uh, send positive vibes into it. That's well, why I keep having these dreams. That. I keep having these dreams. That, and then I, I just found out that... Oh, never mind. I can't say right now. Tell me. Oh, you yeah, can't come right there. Yeah, I'll tell you in a minute. But, like, I feel like I have to... I got the worst luck. I got, like, the worst judge. Everybody else is getting all this low-ass time, and I'm just up here with the judge. I think this isn't too bad. I've never had him, like, court. personally. Every time I went to court, he sentenced everybody to prison. I just, he never, he released one person since I've been here, since I've been to court. Lady Bosque. She's the only person that's ever got to go. Really? Yeah. So she has the same judge. Uh. Hey, why can't my fucking dog comprehend the fact to not fit in the fucking house? Why, what, what's going on with this fucking bitch? How old is your dog? She's like seven, eight months. Not comprehending the fucking fact. No, I got a trainer, right? We did train her. I think it's was when she was a puppy. She got into some mess once or twice. And uh, I think she's like brain damage. Oh, my God. You're going to kill your dog. Like, what's wrong with you? Yeah, I think she's probably brain damage. So she is like... Kind of, because of this concept, like, sit on the grass. Did, did, that, did that number ever text you back? Nope. Ashley's number? Uh, you want me to try to call her or something? No. Oh, I man, he cut her off. Where are you at? Your dad's you know home? That one. Yeah. You know that, right? Huh? That man cut her off. Your what? That man cut Ashley off. I still didn't hear you. I said that man, Rod, Rob, whatever, he cut Ashley off. Yeah, I know. He, yeah, I know. He's not getting that, huh? <laughs> That's sad. Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't know what you expect. I, I know. I read, I read the things and it was horrible. Like, I wouldn't mm-hmm. want to treat like that. I mean, like, mm-hmm. I guess I can't say that. I wouldn't want to get lied to like that. Because I've, uh, I've stayed in work situations, so I can't really say that. I can't believe that uh, she liked it. Like, dude, he, why would you say that to him? So, what, he could, what's the whole point of her doing that so he could, like, take care of her? I don't have no idea the situation. That's crazy. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, last Mm-mm. night was crazy. I tried to call you back because they. I know, what the fuck? Why'd you call me back at 12 o'clock? Because, okay, so, I tried, as soon as I got off the phone with you, the phone. And the whole building went out. I'm like, oh, okay. So then, by the time they came back on, I tried to call you, but your phone was off. So I'm like, what the hell? So then, the phones came back on at like 11 or whatever, and I tried to call you. Then, you didn't pick up. They were only on for like five minutes, but... I was going to tell you oh. that, it, that Abby was being weird. <laughs> I was going to tell on her. She wants to fuck. Well, it was just a yeah, weird night. Yeah, she does. It was just a weird night last night. But she was going the whole You got her to back the fuck up, 10 feet. She was just doing her whole suicidal thing again, like... Oh, why is she doing the whole suicidal thing again? But then it was like, it was because of new people, you know, so she got to do that show thing. Oh, so she had then, to, like, let her pregnancy on. But I wasn't, like, giving in, you know, I wasn't saying anything. Mm-hmm. So, like, she was sitting, like, right next to me. And I oh, right now? Just, no. Last night, that's what I was going to tell you last night. And then out of nowhere, she just grabbed my boots. And she said, wow, you have soft boots. Oh, yeah, I don't like that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. She's being weird. I I'm thrilled. Like, so her, I don't like it. That's good. And then, that's why I was like, what is she doing? And then she, out of nowhere, we had a conversation. She said, like, she's going home next month on house arrest. And she said that she's going to, um, add, me, add us on the kiosk, whatever, add us all on the kiosk. And then, uh, mm-hmm. 
the interesting thing about she was just gay for this day is that if you mean to tell me if you uh got out on her first, you wouldn't call Shane? She's like, she thought about it. She said, no, I probably would. I said, exactly. So she said, she probably would. She said she wouldn't be with a girl outside. She well, probably would be with Where is this coming okay. from? Like, it just came out of um. nowhere. Yeah, I'm so serious, I mean, I don't like that. So you have to tell her, like, or I'm going to write on the kiosk. You don't what? I don't like that. What? That she's grabbing up on you, I don't like that shit. That she was? I didn't like that she's grabbing up on you. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's weird. I don't know what's going on with her. Like, something's... I'm on. serious. Are you listening to the song? I'm so serious. Tell her don't do this. Yeah, and then I yelled at her because she's... Okay, she smacked me in my ear. And I told, I'm like, stop. I'm like, don't do that. Like, that really hurt. Because I have problems. I know. Like, would she be punching on you and dead? I don't know. I, I would tell her, hey, try to punch on me like that, and I'm knocking you out. But she must have been funny because she did it again, and so I snapped. I said, Abby, I said, stop. I yelled at her. I said, you, my ear hurts. You, you see, my ear is ringing now. I said, I have problems with my ear. Do not hit me in my ear. Like, I snapped on her. Yeah, okay. you're one of them who's, like, real calm, cool, and collected, and then when someone, like, when you snap, like you snap. Yeah, like I've, I've been cool with her all up to now. She's just being weird. And it's weird because Ashley thinks that. Ashley keeps telling me that she likes me. Likes me. I'm like, no, she doesn't. I, I know, know, and it's like almost I, like I don't want to like say anything, but I use it actually, like, so whatever, but. I would have, I would have known. You can't right? irritate it over here. I didn't, I don't, didn't pick up on any of that. Like, I don't, I don't. Didn't you tell Ashley a long time ago that like, this is not that home feeling? Well, I mean, I don't, I don't get that vibe from her. I don't know what it is. I don't know. I, she's more like a little sister to me. I don't, I don't feel nothing. You know what I mean? I know, and Abby, Abby goes like the fucking white headed sex child. I think she just wants everybody, and I, maybe that's why, because I don't she's want her. That, that's why she's like irritating me. She got that vagina, hey, and now she wants. Get that pussy sucked on. Huh. <laughs> That's what happened. I don't know. I'm just a bit irritated lately. I've been trying to get moved. They're not going to move me. Yeah, you're about over. I think it's because you're, close, you're, like, you're closer to the court date. You're not, you're just, you're not you're like pretty much like over it. Like, like everything, every little thing's going to aggravate you. Yes. That's like he's going to be in I don't know, because I know I'm going to see him there. I know I, I know I am. Oh, yeah, he's talking to bitch, because I'm definitely going to be there. Yeah, he's going to be there, and I'm nervous, because I should have never wrote that letter. Who, to Al? Yeah. Nervous. Well, didn't you write him another one, apologizing? Yeah, but I don't know how he's going to react. I don't know if... It's still, whether he's sitting there or not, it's still out there in the air that I've already it's said it. It's still up there in the air, no, yeah. He, done, he, says, he, says, he says some shit that's still, he, now you have to explain. You, I, that's the thing, is he doesn't, he hears what he wants to hear. Like, I didn't even say anything bad in the first letter. You know what I mean? I didn't say anything. I should have had you read, read it. I know. But I didn't say anything. I know, I don't know why he didn't read me first. I didn't, like, it was nothing, nothing horrible. Mm -hmm. I didn't. All I did was ask him if he thought it would be cheating or something like that, along those lines. Like, I didn't even say anything that I was or, or that he liked anybody, nothing like that, and he just flipped out. I'm like, damn. So now, know. what happens if you get, if they, like, when they release you, to the sign of it, when, um, I mean, like, how how is this going to work out? How, I mean, like, I, 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 I like, I know... And I would hope that you would like still hold him down like best you can and stuff, like be there for him. But like, are like, are you going to like be with him? That's what he keeps asking me. Like he asks me in every letter if I'm gonna marry him and still be with him and like. Because I mean, he's looking. He's looking at a lot of time. Yeah, he's been here for eight years, but like I told you before, I, like I haven't been there. I haven't been with him emotionally in probably a good couple of years. Like, yeah, I like do. I'm not sure I said that. I'm, I've already been, I've already prepared myself for this. Believe him. I've tried to leave him plenty of times before. It just never worked. Could he? If I, remember I told you I left him and I went to Wisconsin in September? 
Yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah, if I would have never came back, I would never have been here. Three months later, I, I come back three months later, I'm in jail. Like, if I would have never came back, I would never be here. Like, it's fucked up. I would have come back, and three months later, I'm in jail. I know. I left you for ten days, and I only came back. Why can you stay gone for thirteen? Well, I don't even know. If you would say it was confident, we would never met. I know, I know. But I'm just saying, in, in like general, like, I would have never been in this situation. You know what I mean? I know, I'm yeah, yeah I know, yeah. For a reason, but it, I'm glad I met you, but, damn, I've been in here eight fucking Well, it's like, damn, all of the fucking circumstances suck. Like, I'd rather not be in jail. <laughs> I know. Me too, I'd rather not be in there either. I know, but you got lucky you were only here, like, a week. <laughs> I know, but, uh, it's getting, it's getting more out here. Like, I'm going to have a, like, so is that, yeah, the, is that the, um, the dress that you bought? That the black one? Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, I bought, yeah, that's one of them. You can see it that well. Uh, I, I didn't want to, like, the whole... I'm supposed to see the dress, but I don't even see the dress. Well, because it's all, like, it's really, like, a deep V and, like, the back hole, and I didn't, was like, well, last time I thought it was sort of fucking belly, they fucking flipped out. I mean, I still like the picture. It's cute. I just... I'm like, where? I can't see the dress. Yeah, I bought another cute, um, uh, the, I got a couple cute outfits, um, I bought some ones for and I never bought ones. I don't even know, I don't know how to wear it, it's real. So you probably get that letter. Uh, oh, what's that book? What? Remember that book you told me? What book? Oh, the comic book? The book that you, um, the, uh, book you told me about, like, for every day of the week, we can, um, the it's called Thomas Fisher, 365. Yeah, whatever that word is. Well, I can buy one. Well, I don't know. I'm going to see if they have, like, a girl version or something. Yeah, I'm going to see if they have, like, a girl version. I think I'm going to pay, like, $7 or $14. I don't know if it's a terrible amount. So it's called Thomas yeah. Fisher, 365. There's literally a disposition for every day. Have you ever, um, tried on a sex swing? I mean, have you ever... A what? Have you ever done on a sex swing? No, I have not. I think you have it before. No, never have. But, like, that book that I had, I don't... I could probably have my mom's now. But it got... It's like, it's pretty much garbage because it got covered in oil. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you know, like, that sex oil shit. You know, like... When people talk to you on the phone, like, if they didn't know, if they didn't know that you were from Wisconsin stuff, like, you would definitely, like, people, this is how you speak, you have, like, uh, I, uh, like, you speak real, sometimes you speak kind of like a ghetto. Not ghetto, but you can speak to just well, like, you're like from, <laughs> yeah, like, you like a hood accent. Oh, Lord, just to make it fun of me because I have my pants rolled up and I have black, long black chocolate on, and she said it looked like I was in a Mexican gang. Yeah? She said you're in the South Sea Five Gang. Well, hey, when you were seeing South Sea I looked her up, I watched her video. What video? Of her, like, of her trying to escape. Yes. Yeah, I, I seen it, I watched you it. watched your video. Uh, <laughs> uh, it was so funny. funny. She got it so funny. Oh, oh God. It literally is the funniest thing ever. There are 60 seconds remaining. I wish I could send you guys a clip. I'm about to call you back on the phone card. Alright, call me. We'll call you back in like 20 minutes and I'm about to jump in the phone real fast. Alright, I'll give you... You need like at least 30. Yeah, Yeah. I'll give you like 30. Okay, I'll call you back. Alright, let's go. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number followed by the pound sign. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. For calling. Please dial 0. Plus. Hello, this is a collect call from...
an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $27.33. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive Out. information about new affordable per minute rate, no. press 2. Stay to accept Out. this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? Yeah, what's up? You, uh, you said you had information on Jenny? Yeah, they, I called this morning. I got your, your meal taken care of. Anyway, okay. I called this morning and they said they moved her to C6 on the fifth floor. It's a lot smaller. So, you said what? she's not you by said? herself. On the fifth, you said? The fifth? I think that's what she said. The fifth floor is C6. C6? Where's C6 at? Is that the fifth floor? I'm pretty sure that's what she said. I was trying to... The, you said C6? I think so. I don't know. Fifth floor C6? Is that a... Is that... Okay. You said she's with somebody else, you said? It's, she just said she's with other people, but it's a lot smaller than the one she was in. She said she's with other people, but it's a lot smaller than is there a guard there or something like that or anything? Huh? Is there a guard around her or, like, is it safer? You know what she I mean? She said there's guards uh -huh. everywhere all the time. There's guards everywhere all the time. Heather? Mm -hmm. Guards everywhere all the time. And she said she was safe, so... No, she said it's a crazy floor for the crazy people. It's her own kitchen shit everywhere. Well, who knows? Maybe that's where you are. I don't know. I don't know, but... Yeah. Oh, and I put... Hold on here, I had to use your bank card or whatever to pay the dollar or whatever. Yeah. For your... getting your mail. So you had ended up with 5044. Mm -hmm. So I went on there, I put 44 in your book, and then they charged 440, so it came to 4840. So you got two dollars and four cents left on your card. Okay. So there's, I put forty four in your book tonight. Yeah, because I checked it and it said there was forty four in there. Uh, I sent another message. He, uh, yeah, I sent it to him. Did you send him that picture? Of the necklace, yeah. Okay. Uh, what did he say about it? I don't know, he just was happy that I found him on the where, but I never answered him. I don't think I told him where I found him. Oh, if she's on the fifth floor, then that means she won't get her... I don't know, I don't see a fifth floor on there. Well, does she get her found here on the fifth floor? Do you think, Heather? Will she get her found here on the fifth floor? Because I don't see it on the list. I'm just wondering. I'm, yeah, because if she doesn't get her commentary, then I, I don't know. I just find out. Because I heard different information. I heard that she was on the second floor or something with one other person. Uh, you know, Maybe I heard her wrong. I don't know. I don't know. Did she call you at least? No, I haven't heard from her. Yes, I don't know. But I said, hopefully she at least gives, got to meet with her lawyer. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I said, I'm going to see what I can find out. I'm trying to get some more information, and then I'll uh, let you know for sure when I find out. But cause I, don't, there, I didn't even know there was a fifth floor here. <clears throat> so I'm looking at that the thing is tall. Yeah, I'm looking at the commissary delivery, and it's uh, there's a fourth floor, a third floor. Oh, no. Maybe the fourth floor is a secret, or the fifth floor is a secret floor. I thought the, the guys were on the third and fourth floor is what I thought. I don't know. I don't know. I'll try to find out some more information when I can, you know. But, <laughs> they got the mail changed. If, if they won't shut the stuff off, it's whatever. They're just going to have to uh, let the bill rack up. And, you know, that's what I told Larry. I said, I'm not going to go through all that bullshit because they said I'd have to get a power of attorney and then take a piece of paper. Do all that shit is going to 
won't be disconnected, but it don't even matter. Right, because then I'd have to get it. I literally just paid all my bills before I came here. Except for the heat bill, I paid half of it, or part of it. So, (laughs) that fucking sucks. So it's going to be on for like three months before they disconnect me. Probably. Well, there ain't nothing plugged in or nothing running, so... Right. Ain't gonna add up to nothing. Did you shut the heat off? James did, yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. I mean, it shouldn't, shouldn't affect be that much then. But... All right. Yeah. Did you put $20 on Al's books on the 31st? Me, no. Oh, okay. I was wondering, did he? I know, he was asking me if I did. I'm like, uh, no. Maybe someone well, else sent it to him or something. That's what I was thinking. Maybe his mom or sister or something. I don't maybe know. his uh, maybe his friend or something. I don't know. And that's weird. Yeah, because he's like, "Where did that come from?" I'm like, "Oh." Nine more he asked me too. Like, <laughs> that's a said, <laughs> family or or something, you know. Right. Yeah, because I know he has a sister that works in like the law or something like that. So maybe she did. Yeah, maybe. If he keeps getting it, then it's got to be somebody that knows him good. So. Yeah, so I figured, I'm thinking maybe it's his sister. Because they're pretty close. Yeah. Hold on. You're still there, right? Yeah. Yeah. The phone is still working. Yeah. Probably because she's under a blanket. Yeah, you better, somebody better wake her up. This girl won't get up, and if we, our beds are not fucking made, then they should phone the TVs off, so. We better get her up. Yeah, just yeah, she needs to get up. <laughs> well, if they're still sleeping, why would that bother the phone? They're, we're not allowed to, um, because the phones and TVs are all on one button. But I don't know why the phone. But. All right. The phone is still working. <laughs> for now. Huh? Uh, for now. No, it would shut off at the same time. Mm. Fine by me. Why, is the other phone shut off or what? Huh? Well, the other phone shut off or what? Mm-mm. There's only two phones and I'm not on our one. Oh. Uh-huh. Yeah. This lady ain't trying to get up. She wouldn't even get up to do her army account. She wouldn't get up to eat. If she don't get up to uh, make her bed, she's going to have a problem. Hmm. That's our only two. A new one or what? Huh? Is it a new one or what? Mm-hmm. She just got here today. So. No. Yeah. Probably nervous, scared, like everybody, you and Jenny were when Chris got there. Yeah, probably not her first time. Just start chocolate. Yeah. Got our commissary. Mando, like, huh? I said, Mando, like, dark chocolate. I got a candy bar sitting on my bed. It's dark chocolate. I'm like, yuck. I just threw it on my dresser. Who's chocolate? I said, there was a... Larry don't like dark chocolate. And he threw it on my side of the bed. And I'm like, well, I don't like dark chocolate either. So I threw it up on my dresser. Oh, I do. What kind is it? Hey, I don't know, Karen, no. you, you better get up. Damn, for real. Or I'm going to uh, push the button. Dark chocolate, man. You better get up and make your bed. Right. What What kind was it? I don't know. It's, it's, a, what is, it's a square, and it says chocolate squares, dark chocolate mint. Oh, yeah. What's his filling? Yeah, I hope Jenny gets your, uh, hopefully Jenny gets your thermals. I'm a, like I said, I'm going to try to get some more information, and I'll let you know, uh, and all that shit. Man. Yeah. I can say hi to Fuzzy. He's sitting here just listening. Oh. Hey, Fuzzo. What's you doing? You, you ain't going to work no more, Fuzzy, or what? No. I don't work. You waiting for me? You waiting for me to come home? Yeah. You going to give me, give me that bedroom? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Why not? Can, if we can all share, I guess. Yeah, right. My bed's going to take up half the room. <laughs> well, well, all three of us can sit in one bed. It's a king bed. All three of us can sit in one. Uh-uh, I take the whole bed. <laughs> you can snuggle. So I'll give you in the middle. I'm going to take the whole bed. <laughs> oh. 
Well, you and Fuzzy can sleep together. Jenny can sleep in that spare room. <laughs> Good God. He can't. He's got a uh, he's got a baby here to take care of. The <laughs> uh, what? So he's got oh, a baby, baby to take care, care of. Yep, her name is yeah. Mama. Yeah, baby Mama. Mhm. I thought you were in here last night when she called me. Uh-huh. <laughs> you can come visit me anytime you want. Yeah, we'll be out soon. You hear me? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Her birthday is in a little couple next week. Who, uh, Heathers or the babies? Mm-hmm. Huh? Who, Heathers or the babies? Uh, hers? Oh. Sweet. Her babies do like this month or the end of February. Yeah. She said, Fuzz is a baby daddy. <laughs> Funny. Oh, <laughs> <Thank God. laughs> <Anyway>. Baby daddy. <laughs> the girl. Her name is Isabella. You're going to have a baby girl, Fuzzy. You're going to have another granddaughter. <laughs> she's like five pounds right now. She's neat. She's little. Well, she's going to be a preemie then. Well, mm-hmm. she's got a, about a month left to go almost. Mm-hmm. So she should be about, about right. A couple weeks. Oh, well, yeah, about, mm-hmm. maybe about, about a little less than a month. About three weeks. Yeah. They could gain a pound in about that. So. Huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you need to talk to your baby daddy? <laughs> she said, yeah. <laughs> He's right here. <laughs> What's the matter, Fuzzy? I can see you blushing through the phone, Fuzzy. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty red. You see him blushing through the phone. <laughs> <laughs> what was he was? Huh? Nothing. Oh. <laughs> Try to hook him up, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Ten hours away, that ain't going to work. <laughs> no. She likes to run. Well, She'll run to Wisconsin. Yeah. No. Yeah, she said, I feel like running. She, what's she in there for? I don't know. You don't know? Well, I just what's she in there for? Huh? What'd you say? Huh? I didn't say nothing. Oh. She said, oh, God, a lot. A lot? Hmm. I don't know. Her own mother. That's all I can say. <laughs> From her own mother. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. Well, I hope Jenny called you. Something. Yeah. Or write a letter to you or something. Any damn thing, yeah. Well, she, I mean, it used to write to you, but you won't be able to figure out or receive it. I don't know. Well, let's just look you don't know how to do that messenger thing. That's what huh? I said. I'll, I'll, I'll let you know when I find out more information. Is there a mm-hmm. fifty-four here? No. A what? I was asking Blair. Okay. I don't think there was a fifth floor, is there? No, are you talking not. to me or are you talking to somebody else? Because oh, you're talk to there's, not else a, there's not a fifth floor here, Mom. I was asking Blair. Yeah, maybe maybe she is on the second floor then. Because somebody else told me today that she's on the second floor in a two-man cell, or a six-man cell with one person, another high-profile case. That way there's two No, because she said that she was with a high pro- she was with high-profile cases. Yeah, so that's what I heard, too, because I got information, too, from somebody else in here, that she said that she's in a six-man cell, which mine is... Mine is holds twelve people, so she's in one with six people, but it's only her and one other girl that's also a high profile case. So they should get along, you know what I mean? Right. So and she should have a TV and phone, kiosk, all that in there. So maybe her roommate will help her with the phone and stuff if she has your number. Yeah. Or maybe I could talk to one of the guards and they give you give her your number. She needs something because. Yeah, like I said, maybe they can. I can talk to her. I only got to talk to her once. So. Yeah, that's what I said. Maybe I'll, I'll see if somebody, maybe uh, one of the, the guards that got her moved for me, because I had I talked to numerous guards, and the, as soon as I told one of them, she got it done right away, immediately. As soon as I told her, she walked right over there and got her moved. So she's she's yeah. on that. Hopefully, she's here tonight. I don't know. Mm. But I'm I'm waiting for her to so I can find out. Uh, maybe she, I can. Yes, or sorry to call you or something, you know, or 
Mm-hmm. Five hours got the number. So. Could call me around five or six tomorrow night then. Okay. Unless she wants to tonight, but I'll be going to bed probably around seven, so it'll be eight your time. Yeah, like uh, I'll try to get try to get uh, information, just get her your number. So. Do my best. Okay. All right. Well, well, yo, tell Fuzzy to have my bedroom ready until I'm get the baby bedroom ready. Well, I already got a crib. Oh, he's got a crib already. Like he said, he's got a crib already. <laughs> oh, that's all. It's all pink too for a girl. It's all pink. To my knees. Yeah. It's ready to roll. <laughs> okay. All right. I love y'all. Love it too. All right. Bye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. One moment, one moment, for collect call press 1, please dial 0, press. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail, with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presiones 2. The current balance for your account is $26.99. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable permitted rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. Block all. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello. Hello. What are you doing? I'm just packing Larry's lunch for tomorrow. Starting to sprinkle, so I'm outside having a cigarette at Fort Fox Warren again. You got everything unpacked and camping? Yeah. You got my message about everything I need you to do? Hello? Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. <laughs> one moment. One moment. For collect call press. Please dial zero. Plus. Hello, this is a free call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presiones 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello. Hello. What you doing? Sitting out having a cigarette? It's be nice. I need one. Yeah. You get home, you won't even want it. Bullshit. <laughs> <clears throat> um, do I have a message on there yet or you didn't check it? I just checked it. It was sitting here that was about to eat. You probably know you Damn it. You probably get it right out from sitting Right now, one will be. Damn it. Don't forget, I gotta be working at 10 tomorrow, so. You have to be working at 10? Yeah. Time to get kind off. of. You'll be home around 5. Oh, okay, so I can call you after dinner then? Mm hmm. Alright. I got my eye care today. I like it. Yeah. Meat. Got lots of meat. Yeah. That's what I made tonight. You here. Meat and cheese wrap. Yeah. Yep. That's good. Oh. excited. She got her eye care. So it doesn't give you the option to put a message on there no more? No. It did. I think it asked me twice, and that was it. Now don't ask me anymore. Yeah. That's um. Hmm. And there's no icon or anything you can push. I've tried. It looked nothing. Yeah, I figured. Huh. 
Um, otherwise, I would have. Yeah. <coughs> I don't know what's from anyway. Yeah, I'll check in before I go to bed. I'll go down and finish reading. I'm like halfway done with my second book. Yeah. Yes, yeah. people, we'll go in a minute. You wanted to come out. You were out before I was, so you can just quit yourself. So, oh, Princess? Yes. <laughs> God. <laughs> cold. Oh, baby. It's cold. Alright, well, is this phone call free? Yeah. Oh, well, damn, I hate to waste for a phone call. What's going on? I don't know, he's in the house. He said he's in the house? Yeah. He's trying to come out here. <laughs> My ass is going to stay out here. He said, yeah. I might as well take the whole free phone call then and shit. <laughs> you said you looked at him? He said, what? I thought I asked him, he was out here for a little bit, but he went back in. I said, you're going to stay out here. Man, will be called. Nah. What asshole? What's Larry doing? Sleep? No, he's got off tomorrow. He had to stay off to look fishing. Oh, he's still, still fishing? Huh? He's still no, fishing. they weren't. No, him and Johnny and James want fishing. They're back home now. Oh, where'd they go? Lake Geneva. Lake Geneva? Isn't it, isn't that like two hours away? Yeah. Oh, damn. I caught a shit ton of perch. Did they? Mm. <laughs> Does anybody know if a stay-at-home order? What is he doing? I know it. That's Larry for you. <laughs> <laughs> Larry. <laughs> God. As long as he keeps his, his distance, he's probably cold. six feet apart. What's up? Right? <laughs> you have to have standards, I don't have any chips left. Yeah, yeah she'll take those. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm going to try a new beer. It's called Hemp Tails. It's called what? Hemp Tails. Say it one more time. H- Hemp. H-E-M-P. H-E-M-P. Tails. T-A-I-L-S. Tails? Hemp tails? What the fuck is that? Tails, you know, like a dog tail. Oh, what the? Well, still, what is that? Hemp tails? Is it dark? It's eight percent alcohol. I don't know. Somebody said it's really good, so I'm gonna try your. Uh-huh. Is it dark? Dark beer? I don't know. <laughs> I've never tried it. <laughs> well, you don't have. I'm gonna try it when I, I'm gonna try it before they close up. So if I like it, I'm gonna get some more. <laughs> yeah, you better stock up. <laughs> yeah, we ain't got a whole lot of beer left in the cooler. Everybody's been buying that shit up. Right. Every time they come in, they buy a whole case of big cases and bottles. Oh, man, they just buy, buy it right up. So how many people in Wisconsin have it? What's the numbers? I have no idea. Uh, there's a case in Kaz. Really? They're talking about as of June 1st, they might be shutting down all the post offices. So they do that and then might as well set everything down. <clears throat> yeah, that's crazy. How, who's got it? I don't know. Lyle knows him. Because you know there's a no man cure for it, right? Case. Die. Huh? There's no cure for it, so whoever has it is not going to die. You just die. Yeah. Yeah, they don't get better. So whoever has it is not going to die. Ain't that crazy? So that's why yeah, you're right. home to stay away from people. Yeah, when I'm done work, I will. Yeah. Do you wear a face mask? No. You should. They gave us a face mask, but don't do no damn good because they keep burning people in anyway, so. Yeah. yeah. If you don't want to die, you don't lay down. Don't lay down. You have to keep walking. And every... The episode will last for 20 minutes, and you want to you you you'll be puking, you'll have bad headache, and, and pain. But if you lay down, all the pain and your headache goes away, and you feel so relaxed. That's when you can't breathe and you die. What the fuck? I ain't heard that shit. Where'd you hear that? A man that has it. Is he still alive? Yeah, he was in the hospital bed. <laughs> He told the nurses, whatever you do, do not let me lay down. He was sitting up in the bed. Yeah. So, yeah. 
crazy. I forgot where he was, the boy. He was on Facebook. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, that hits. Yeah, you better stay away from people. Stay home. Because they said that the worst is yet to come. The worst is going to be between the, uh, April 15th and May 15th. So yep. That's when the peak goes up. It's going to be a while, so stay home. <laughs> Yeah. I don't even think we're allowed to leave the state, so what happens to let us out? <laughs> Come what? No. We're stuck? We're stuck. Fucked up. No, I know you're stuck. Huh? <laughs> Said I know you're stuck. What are you going to do on? This late? Why'd you bring her out? She was cold. She wanted to go back in. She was dancing by the door. Well, when you leave, you put her back in there, because she was fucking cold. She was all running around out here. Who you talking to? Fuzzy. No. You still out there? Yeah, he's out now. My speaker? Yeah. No. Yeah, I was on speaker. That's why I was like, I hope you don't talk about certain things, when, like when Larry's on the phone. Yeah, I know. What's going on, Fuzzy? James. Sitting here with Tucker. Oh. Is it warm out up there yet? Well, it was warm all day. It's like 32 right now. Oh. They got the, um, cor- if I look out the window here, by my bed, this is Corner's office. They got a yeah. uh, big uh, refrigerator trailer type thing for dead bodies in case they need it. And then they got two more trailers at the stadium to back up. Yeah. It's get bad. No, well, it's going to get worse before it gets better. You seen that video in New York that from the, got the hospitals recording? They was just throwing dead bodies in the trailer. In the uh, mm-hmm. semi. Yep. It's, it's gonna be crazy. Ain't gonna make nobody left. I know. That's what China wants, I think. Somebody said it was a Christmas present from China, but it was a little late. Okay. That's fucked up. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's yeah. weird. You can thank good old Donald Trump for this. Well, it ain't his fault that we got it. Oh, I'm sure it is. <laughs> he was with the people who had it, brought it over, and how, how do you not? Ha- how does he not have it? He's he, there's a cure for it. He's just trying to kill the population off. Mm-hmm. It's population control, so he can work on. Being president again, and oh, I found the cure for Corona. It's all Trump. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I don't listen to that shit. Mm-hmm. I just hope that now I get this fucking place. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. As far as Jenny knows, she still has court Wednesday, so. Wednesday? I thought it was Thursday. Wednesday the 8th. Eight. <clears throat> what time? Wow. Was it one or two? I don't remember. One two, two, I think. Two. So you have to tell her to call you when she gets back or whatever. Yeah. yeah. She usually does or she messages me or whatever. So I'll call you after that then. I don't know what happened. Got a big pimp on my nose and it hurts so bad. I got one like right in the middle of my forehead. Ripped to my eyes. Fuck, it's huge. <laughs> Between that and my fucking hair is getting all fucked up because it's so long and I can't get anywhere to get it cut and it's pissing me off. How fun is it to cut it? Oh yeah, I'd be bummed. <laughs> you want to cut it? Amanda said you're supposed to cut my hair. I said, yeah, I'd be bald. <laughs> <laughs> Shave it all off, it's fine. Well, baby, that's what I'm going to do. He goes, no, you ain't. That's what you lost me. <laughs> <laughs> I said, you know I have a set issue with my hair. It's got to be just certain, you know, when I don't like hair around my ears. It's all weird. Yeah, right. I would be bald. <laughs> Fuck. I would love to see that. <laughs> hey, Fuzzy, I got a new beer we have to try. I got a new beer on the table. It's called Hemp Tails. There you go. Just drink a couple beers and then tell Larry to cut your hair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Larry would do a too bad of a job. <laughs> Might be a little crooked. Eight percent alcohol. Somebody says it's really good. <laughs> I'll try it. Dark. If we like it before before I uh, 
close the store. If we do, I'll buy more. <laughs> I'm not big you on cable. With you? No, it's on cable. I don't know if it's getting real one or not. I'm going to lock in the door. Where's my Jeep at? Right over there by the sunset. Oh, by the sunset. Did anybody drive it? I made it a couple times. Where are you driving to? Just, uh, the on the store and back. Oh. <laughs> we, we, took, we took it to his mom and dad's and back once. I think we only drove it a couple times. Oh, so did you guys clean it out? Fire. Yes, I cleaned it out and I got new seat covers in it. New seat covers? <clears throat> I didn't have any? Yeah. Yeah, you did, but they fucking were so rotten, they ripped right oh. in half. You <laughs> <laughs> take them off and they ripped right off. They were rotten. What color are they? Black with, uh, like, a mint color. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, because I think, I, I don't know where the mats are. I think it might be, probably still mats. Yeah, they're, oh, we found them. They're in the wagon. Oh, you found Say them? hi, Larry. Larry's out here. Say hi. Hi, Larry. Hi. What you doing? You here? Mm-hmm. What you doing? Bullshitting. <laughs> Just bullshitting, you said. Yep. Yep. I can't wait to go fishing. I want to learn mm -hmm. how to carp shoot. That's what I want to do. So Larry's got to teach me how to carp shoot. Or shoot you hear that? Uh -huh. Yep. Tell him don't dive. But don't <laughs> Tell him stay home. Yeah, it's going to get worse. But yeah. I think everybody's going to get it before... It's over. Don't say that. Well, that's what everybody's saying. Oh. If you stay home and stop going fishing. <laughs> I didn't go fishing. <laughs> Talk to Larry. He wasn't no. around no people, so. All right, as long as you're isolated, no groups. Some people get arrested here because they had a house party. It was clearly just on the news. Do not have a house party because you're not supposed to be in groups of four or more. But people don't listen. You they don't. More that's more, it. They're gonna get arrested, so don't hang out. With there was so many. More more. There was so many people out today, yeah, and a lot of people business. from Illinois. And that and there's a lot of cases in Illinois, and people are coming here. And they can have it and bring it to us. Exactly. That's why you gotta stay home. And they come in the store, and yeah, you gotta go to the store and uh, stock up on food and toilet paper and isolate yourself in the house. Yeah. Somebody said that before long, um, well, they're already starting to dump milk out, cow's milk, the farmers are. Um, Why? Because of the schools and uh, nobody's open. There's no places to take it. Damn. Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, uh, Damn, so I'd probably put Larry out of some work, huh? No, she's still working. Yeah. So some some people are around here. We can struggle with. Yeah, it's over four dollars a gallon. Well, if there's too much milk to give out, then she'd be going down. I don't know, but somebody said that pretty soon there's going to be a shortage on food. I bet. Because every that's why you guys should stock up and get as much as you can. You can't get nothing. Can. You can't get nothing from the distributors. Nobody has anything. They're out, and uh, that's one reason we're closing down, too, because we can't get anything we order. Right. Um, so you should stock up. Get as much stuff as you can, because you never know. And make sure you got plenty of ammo and, ammo and guns, because people are going to start breaking in people's houses for food and shit. Uh-huh. It's going to be a whole purge out there, huh? Yep. It's going to be like the apocalypse. I ain't the only one that says that. Just another guy at, at work, a special guy comes in, he says, just like the zombie apocalypse. There I said, that's go. what I said. <laughs> right. Yep. The corona apocalypse. There you go. Yeah. Make sure you check the message before um, you go to bed or whatever. Yeah. In case you get cut off, because I know it's going to be coming soon. Yeah. yeah. Make sure you guys stock up, get everything you need, even Walmart. Down here, we're saying that only 20 people in the store at a time. Uh, this is yeah, a little over four minutes. You hear me? What? 
I said Walmart was only letting 20 people in at a time. You go, as soon as someone comes out, not another person come in. Like, it's crazy. Yeah, I think that's what we were starting to do, too. And, uh, the Menards is telling people that they only can come in at one or two. They can't bring a whole family and they don't want kids allowed in the store. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you guys you and Larry, if you got off, you got to go to the store, stock up on everything you need. Get tons of tons got of no money. money. Well, I'll use you your have, money. You have my car, you can use it. That way, I don't have to keep going out. Just get tons of food and salt paper. That way, you can stay home and hopefully get past it and I have to worry about going out nowhere and getting it. Make sure. They said, they said on the uh, news, they cover your face up. Don't even have to do the mask. Fucking put a sock around your damn face. Put an All right. Shirt. So some people use scarves. You know, you said that this is where you walk up the door. I'm like, fuck. Just use, um, yeah, something to cover your face. No, about the card. I said you said that this is where you walk out the fucking door. No, oh, what do you say? Or what do you, do you hear me? Nothing. I hope we didn't hear you. Oh. Well, it can be a credit card. You know what? You can just tell them it's my emergency credit card. They won't know. Yeah. Tell them I got five thousand dollars on it. Well, four thousand, two thousand, thousand doesn't matter. <laughs> but yeah, if you mm -hmm. got to, like I said, stock up, get some food, get some toilet paper. We guys don't have to keep going out. Get through this, this month, and hopefully after this month, between April fifteenth and May fifteenth, hopefully after this, so help. But stock up, get some toilet paper, tampons, whatever you need. All right. Make like you one good trip. Too bad you guys didn't have a damn Sam's Club or something where you can get buy in bulk. Don't you guys have one of those? I don't go to Madison. I used to. You want a bear bill? No. Oh, All right, Larry's going back out so I don't talk about cards no. anymore. No, but yeah, I thought there was one in bear bill. To buy no, in bulk. well, there's ain't much in bear bill, just Walmart and mm -hmm. I don't know, Menards. Yeah, you guys need that. You need to store up there where you guys can buy in bulk. <laughs> Shit, order on Amazon. <laughs> 30, yeah, half, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, half the 30, shit is out of stock on Amazon. I bet, I believe it. <laughs> there are 60 seconds uh, remaining. 60 seconds left, so. I'll call well, you I'll tomorrow minute. night after dinner then. Alright, I should be home around quarter to five, five o'clock somewhere there. Alright, love you. Check the message. Alright. Right. Yep. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number followed. <laughs> one moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $19.99. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2 to accept this call. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello, I've been waiting for you to call. Like, first time I called, I was, the first time I was in the shower. Did you uh, get a hold of anybody? Well, I, uh, that Flanagan one, and I talked to Dennis, well, he called me back, I mean, I was waiting on it. His name is Dennis, oh, what the fuck, Lib Liberman, he works with that Flanagan. Oh, he works for but Anyway, yeah. Okay, what is that? Or in, in, he's like, for the case that you're looking at, it'd be 10000 Okay. Needs half up front. Huh? Okay, I'm listening. He needs half up front, which would be five. 
I got two in your account. So I asked if he could help. I haven't heard from him yet. But, but what did he say? Does he think he can get me out? <sighs> well, I mean, he said he he can't really do anything until we... He won't right. be able to come see you or anything until we hire him. Okay, well, if we pay him fucking $10,000, he better fucking get me out. Because my lawyer messaged me and said um, that he talked to Al's lawyer and he said something about um, Al told him that Jenny pulled a gun on him, but we don't. Ha I, I don't know where that came from. I'm like, no, she put a knife on him. Remember that time I told you that? Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, I told my mom about it. That's, that's why she was about to go back home and, and stay in Wisconsin. I, I couldn't take care of her no more. So I don't know. I, I think he, Jenny and him are going at each other, and I'm just stuck in the fucking middle. So. Yeah, and you know what? He could be saying stuff about you as well and not saying anything. That's what I'm saying. I'm, I don't know what is going on. They're both going at each other, and I'm just stuck in the fucking middle. So fuck both. All right, and Jenny's not... Jenny's not saying anything about you negative. Yeah, but she uh, I told you that, too. Well, I talked to her last night, and she was had a bad day. When I told her what was going on, she started crying, and she was, like, flipping out. Yeah, so she wouldn't be doing that if she didn't say it. You know, if she wasn't saying it. You know what I mean? I, I'm going to want to say it. I don't anyway. know what's going on. I just know that I'm stuck in the fucking <laughs> middle between all this shit and... Don't know what's going on, and I'm still in here. Right, but he okay. said he's been doing cases like this for 40-some years, and... Yeah, that's yeah. what I've heard. I've heard he's, he's the best, so... All right, so okay, I'm trying to get... Your money, you should, you should be able to get me the fuck out of here. Because my, my lawyer, right. he's still talking about house arrest. I don't want house arrest. I don't want to go home to this house here. I want to go all the way home to Wisconsin. If I get out of house arrest... I have nothing at home for me. It's not going right. to be so good. Nothing there. I'm sure they shut the lights off by now. Cause they... Oh, yeah, I'm sure. But, I mean, all the, but... I mean, besides that, that, I mean, they fucking blast my house on the news. So, I mean, I'm not not going home. I want to go right. home. So. But you're just looking at manslaughter, right, not murder? I don't know what I'm looking at. Because if, he, if it's murder... If it's murder, he'll want fifteen thousand. I don't. Have if it's just manslaughter, he'll do ten thousand. That I, that's what I'm saying. I don't have any idea because they fucking my lawyer has not told me anything. All right. Well, we'll just stick with the manslaughter. It's cheaper, and if something comes up, but he will take payment plans afterwards. We just have to get something set up. Um, but I told him I had two thousand, which you do a little over two thousand on your card. But yeah. I don't want to use all, so I'll leave, yeah, like, 300 on there. Yeah, because yeah, you got, like, I don't know, but I'll use 2,000 of that, and then I'll see if I can get another 3,000 from somewhere. So it won't help me. I'll try to go out and get a loan or something. I don't know. I have to do something. But uh, then we'll figure out how to get that to him. And then he, as soon as yeah, I can tell, get that to him. If you got to, just tell Larry that I got 2,000 on my card. I was trying to save in case I needed to hire a lawyer or something. No, if you said, right. where did that come from? Yeah, well, she had, had it. She was trying to say, right. cause I wanted to hire a lawyer to get Josiah back, but I didn't get myself out first. So, that's all I know so far. As soon as I figure out anything, then I got... He gave me his work phone and his cell phone, so I can call either one. Okay, yeah. So, figure it out and call him back, because my lawyer, like I said, he... He's not making any sense. He just messaged me and said something. That, he said that he talked to Al's lawyer and said something about a gun. I'm like, what are you talking about? I don't, he won't have any guns. And then he said, well, I think it's best that you um, go against Al and Jenny. I'm not against anybody. I just want to get out. Like, I don't have anything to do with this. You know what I mean? Like, this is just ridiculous. Right. And he told me that Jenny... That's all I know for now. And he told me that Jenny's... Um, Jenny's man, uh, involuntary manslaughter charge was a misdemeanor. Like, how is that even possible? Like, I don't, I don't know. I'm just tired of this shit. No, yeah, well, I'm um, trying to do the best I can over here. So, all right. Not... So, if Larry, um, he has three thousand, whatever. Let me know if you guys can help with it. Just tell him to come see me. <laughs>
And as soon as he gets the money, he can come see you. So. You can tell him, um, he, my lawyer, Lucas Wilder, right now, he can get in touch with him and fucking get all the, whatever he needs to see from him. But, um. Well, he was going to start looking it up already <laughs> on the right, computer. Yeah. And then, um, and then I was going to say, uh, what was I about to say? Um, oh, as far as loans, I, you remember that Moby loan? They'll probably give, they'll probably give you a loan. If you have to. It'll go right into your account and you'll get the next day. They gave me $1,800. So I imagine it, they'll probably give you all some money too. But yeah, it's Moby loan. Remember that loan that I had you redo for me? Hello? Hello? What's up? This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number followed by the pound sign. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $29.84. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? What you doing? Oh, just got to talk to Jenny. Oh, did you? What you doing? Not doing much. But they were sleeping most of the day or laying down. I don't know. Yeah, because I heard they got their stuff off again. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why, but it was off. Yeah. Probably because if you go onto your blanket, you're not allowed to have no phones or TVs all day. You said they weren't under it, they were laying on it. Um, I don't know. Could be any number of reasons. No. I ain't checked the uh, computer yet. Do I have a message? Mm, I don't. I think so, unless it was this morning, so I don't know. I don't remember. I mean, I checked it at like 2.30, but I haven't checked it since then. I didn't know if you oh. sent one yet or not. Um, I'm trying to see. Uh, yeah, you got my message this morning. Oh. Yeah, honey, you don't have to worry about telling him. If you don't want to send one, you don't have to send one. I, I, I texted him last night or whatever, and he never texted back, so like, whatever. That's what I said, I'm not worried about it. You know you ain't gonna get nothing from him anyway. Yes. Too bad. <laughs> he wouldn't give me a dollar if he had it. <laughs> Probably not. Right. He's stingy. What's Fuzzy doing? Is he at Johnny's? No, he's in his room. Oh. You don't want to talk to me or what? I don't know. He was listening to Jenny, but then he gave up and he went to his room. I want to. I'll call Larry to tell him that you're on if you want. And then, hold on. Well, you can talk, I guess. Oh, my God. I don't feel good. Mm -hmm. He said he was listening to Jenny for a little bit. I'll tell Fuzzy that Amanda's on now if you want to talk. He's been at Johnny's all damn week. <laughs> Falling down, I keep losing weight. Ugh, terrible. What? You are? Yeah. Why? I don't know. I need to eat some more. All day yesterday. You threw up all what? day yesterday? Yeah. Is there yet? What's up, yeah, he's right here. Better the chance all damn week. week. Come on, let's take your bag and move in with him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
Yes. What? What? What the hell was that? Oh, I'm picking up from me. Like, what? I'm fucking his belly. Oh, you got a job yet? Oh. Yeah. Where? <laughs> Playing PlayStation. Where? Where? Playing PlayStation 4. PlayStation. A job that pays. <laughs> 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 Playing PlayStation 4. Playing PlayStation 4. Playing PlayStation 4. Playing PlayStation 4. Playing <laughs> that is funny. You go on that PS4 and send me an eye care then. I want the biggie. <laughs> he wants the big one. hundred some bucks. hundred bucks. Make it happen, bud. <laughs> Better yeah. go work that corner. Okay. <laughs> right. Just go out there with your little cup and just sit and put a sign up saying that you're homeless. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You sound it to everybody knows everybody and uh yeah. They know better. Good medicine. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, fuck that. Oh okay. That's funny. You gonna send me the biggie cousin? We'll win the lottery maybe. Yeah. What's wrong with your brother, Cousin? Everything. What you mean everything? Did he get his book for you know? Mm-hmm. I asked him last night to get his postcard in the mail on the sex they never texted You're me. with Johnny every day. Why he won't text me back or send me a night care? I don't know. You never responded back to mine either, though, so fuck off. Yeah, because I got moved that day and I had to wait for my damn, um, they had to transfer my thing over to this computer and it took all day and then every day I called and like, Johnny and, and that, there, Johnny's that every day. Because you wasted my 50 cents to open that damn message, and all it said was one damn sentence. <laughs> you better send me a whole paragraph. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I can say. Nothing new's happening. All right, that's why I just call. But, uh... Well, I'm never here when you call. What's wrong with your brother? You know him. You're there every damn day. I don't know. I try to get him He's long. stingy. He's just fucking stingy. Well, I get him, to, when he comes in the store, I say, can you buy this for me? He just laughs in my face. I'm like, seriously? What is he <laughs> take his credit card. Take his credit card. And he didn't order me one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Tell him what's right. to see. Tell, now, tell him he owes me the biggie now. This is fucking cheap ass. Tell him he owes me a hundred bucks. <laughs> yeah. No, I just spent my, uh... I just told why I ordered shampoo and they brought me damn conditioner. I gave it back. I'm like, um, I need shampoo. Well, oh, Jenny needs conditioner. So <laughs> she needs conditioner and, and deodorant. Yeah, good luck with that. I need deodorant too. That's just five dollars. That's why I was either to buy, whether I buy shampoo or deodorant. So I, I bought shampoo. My conditioner is okay. about half I told her. I add water to it and shake it really good, and yeah. you don't have to last it. So I get money on there, and I can do yeah. butter right now. Yeah, she can always borrow some from people, too. And she really, her with her hair, she don't really need it. Her is so cool. She really just uses shampoo at home. Well, she uses that two-in-one, really. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Peter is almost free, so you said Al didn't message me yet. I don't know, I'll check. Okay. Well, I'll give it. I sent, I sent him the one that you had on there when I got home, but I... Okay. I'll, I'll check to see if it's on. There's still people on the computers right now anyway, so... But, you know, I just want you to know that I sent you the message and I sent, sent that letter out, so... Or whatever. Fuzzy, you're getting something in the mail from me. Okay. It's all in one envelope, one for me, one for Larry, one for... Her. Yeah, it's all in the same envelope. But if if you write back or anything, Fuzzy, it I don't actually get the um letter. They they scan it and it goes on the computer. So just so you know, <laughs> which is stupid. Mm-hmm. I w- wish we could just get paper letters, but <laughs> right. Yeah. But 
Yeah, Johnny's a little stingy ass. Tell him, tell him my, uh, my damn birthday coming up. <laughs> tell him to send me something. Uh, Alright. Alright. Well, I'll let you go, but, uh, yeah. I'll call you tomorrow. I'll go check the computer in a little bit. Okay. Alright, love you. Love you, Buzz. Love you, too. Alright. All right. Bye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID. One moment. One moment. For a collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Plus. Hello, this is a free call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español, presione dos. Turn your brother's chair, I'm a poor in the kitchen. Press three now. You block all. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? I'll put white in it, or just add white to it. You what? Yeah. Yeah. Where's Johnny? Still in the kitchen, or somewhere. I don't know. I'm still in the bedroom. Oh, I was about to tell him something. No. Tell him I'm still waiting on my birthday, I care. Yeah, he heard you. Yeah, what do you say about that? I just laugh. Right, asshole. Tom's an asshole. <laughs> Grayson did a better job in front of the camera than, than I did. <laughs> uh, it doesn't pick up very good. It's weird. Uh, we were all sitting right in front of the damn camera. I don't know. And then it just says that they're not facing the camera or whatever. Oh. No. Then you guys are only like an inch big at, at times. Fucking stupid. Yeah, it was weird. Is it a walker? No, huh, No. No. Oh. Just lay it down, cover up. I got the thing on her. I'll be right with her. We're just getting her ready for a Yeah, I just in the discharge planner. She um, sure. she just wanted to know if I needed anything. I was in clothing, food. If I get out of here, I said, well, I haven't even been to court yet. So uh -huh. she, I said, I'm supposed to go next week. So she's going to come see me again after court to see how it went and if I need help with anything. Mm -hmm. I said, if anything, I just need some clothes so I can get the fuck home. I said, because once I get out of here, I'm going back to the fountain. Yeah. What you doing? Let's make out and have a cigarette. Let's be lying down. Is that just lying down? Well, I just laid her down. She wants to go to sleep. She wants to sleep. How long you got her till? I don't know. Yeah. Look off of an ass, really? Oh, that's really lightheaded. What'd you say? What? What'd you say? What'd you say? I said, how long do you have Grayson for? I have no idea. Oh. In and out, working on the tracer. Oh, Johnny's been dicking around? <laughs> I think they just came back to hey. something to eat. Can't wait to see her. She's getting big. Yeah. She's acting like she can't walk. At her house, she walks all around the living room. She sent me pictures. And here she's not doing it. She says, Grandma, upset. pick me up. Pick me up, Grandma. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you pick her up all the time? Yeah, she's in bed now. <clears throat> uh, what's she doing? You, you said you're sitting in your bedroom? I'm not having a cigarette. Oh, yeah, I'm having a cigarette. Who's out there, Johnny and Fuzzy? No, they're leaving. Oh, what the fuck? They just came home to get something to eat, I said. Oh, good lord. I told you I wanted to talk to Johnny. Oh, he's already in the truck. Right. Yeah, so, so, well, when you see him, he comes back, tell him I said I'm still waiting. Like, I care. Hmm. My birthday, tell I John, care. Tell, tell Johnny he's, he's still waiting for his I care. My birthday, I care. 
Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I care. James, happy loves you. Goodbye. All right. Love you too, bud. Hey, Johnny. She's still waiting on her birthday. I care. He said good God. He ain't no good God nothing. Tell him to smack him. <laughs> He's already back in home. That's all he says is good God. Good God. He's still in the Yep, that he is. Yeah, yeah. Except from his fucking father. Yes. And when he's still like put her fists up at you to slap you in the face, he's a little, little booger. Who, oh, Grayson? Yeah, she's a meanie butt. I seen Jenny's name on the list. I said, Have you talked to my sister yet? She's like, Oh, who's your sister? I'm like, Right here. I pointed out, I said, Ebert. I said, She's going to be said the same thing. Once we get out of here, we're going back to Wisconsin. I said, he. So she stays with me, so. It's hot as fuck. And Jenny's at court the six, last I do. Yeah. Well, I'm hoping I still go to court. I messaged my lawyer and asked him if I was still going to court. Because with the corona going on, they're not going into the courtroom. They're doing it in front of a video. And my lawyer said that we needed to actually be in the courtroom. So mm -hmm. I don't fucking know. But there's somebody here with the corona. I'm like, yeah, yeah well, right. your, your state's supposed to open back up on the first. What is? Your, your lift off, whatever, the stay at home or whatever the fuck they had going on down there is supposed to lift on the 1st. Oh, in Ohio? Yeah, I think until the 26th now of May. God damn. Why? I don't know. Hey, Rebecca. My mom said that Ohio's stay at home order is to be lifted on May 1st. Wisconsin isn't until May 26th. That's because we didn't close ours down until after. Huh? Because ours wasn't put down until after years, guys. Yeah, but still, that's a long time. Well, then he added another month. So if I, they let me out of here, you, uh, you, you're going to have to tell John he's going to say about work or something. He can drive my Jeep down if he got to. But y'all got to come get me immediately. Okay. Yeah. I ain't trying to stay here at all. Stephanie had court today, so I'm waiting to hear back from her to see how it went. I don't know. I sent her that message, so I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, because her out date isn't until August 12th. But with this corona going on, they're letting everybody out. So if they let her out, I don't know where she's going to stay at. So I'm trying to figure out. I don't know. Yeah, so hopefully. Cause I told that discharge lady, I said, look, when I get out, I'm going back to Wisconsin. <laughs> but I ain't staying here. Yeah, but don't want to have courts and stuff going on yet? No, I'm saying when it's all done and over with. Oh, yeah. Over with us and all that, I want to get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. I don't know. Yeah, because if they bring the truck, then I can hopefully go into the house and get some more stuff. I don't I don't even know what's left in my house or what my house even looks like. Yeah, I don't either. Uh, but I don't either because I never got to go. Um, to work. Um, what is, uh, I'm to say, was there anything new on the news at all? I don't, I don't watch the news, but I look up on the thing and I haven't seen nothing on there yet, so. Uh, yeah, because I don't watch the news here. I imagine yeah. with us having court here in a little bit, because he's got court at the 30th, too. Yeah. He's got, he's got court at 9, and then I got court at 1. So you have to let me find out how it goes and let me know. Yeah. Head. I don't know. I think it's just like a motion to suppress. Try to throw anything that's not needed or whatever the fuck. Yeah. yeah. I hope I keep the fuck out of here. That'd be nice. Yeah. But if Jenny made a deal, why would she make a fucking deal? That don't make no sense. I don't know. It's six life, I guess. That's stupid. Why would you make a deal on something that's, I don't know. I'm not fucking making no deal. I'm, I ain't do shit, so I want to go home. Fuck that. That's my deal. That's me on. All right. You know. Well, tomorrow, tomorrow night, they're coming over for supper, and we're going to have cake. She's going to have ice cream cake for her birthday tomorrow. Who is? Johnny Jason? Then? What time are they coming over? Uh, about four or so. 
So that'd be what, 3 o'clock here? Be 5 o'clock there. 5 o'clock? Alright, I'm calling after 5. Between 5 and 5 30. And I'm gonna talk to Johnny. <laughs> Tell him I'm still waiting on my chair. Yeah, then I'll hear it. I don't even talk. There's my dragon. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What kind of cake is she gonna have? Winnie the Pooh? I don't know, ice cream cake, because she likes ice cream. Oh, she's she like her auntie. <laughs> <laughs> and she likes bologna and the mashed potatoes and beans, so that's what she's having. How many, um, how many, uh, bags of Doritos do you guys end up getting out of my house? <laughs> I don't know, quite a few. They're all gone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because I am addicted to shopping, so I just buy stuff and buy stuff and buy stuff, and then I just put it in my house and forget about it. <laughs> Yeah. I'm like, I know there's a lot of Doritos because I had some in my bedroom, some in the on the fridge, some on the food shelf. I just had them everywhere. Yeah, and there was a bunch of just regular chips too. Yeah. Because when it was on sale or whatever, I'd have a lot of coupons for Walgreens. So I would just buy it. Yeah. It'd be like two for four dollars, and then I'd have a three dollar off coupon, so I'd only pay a dollar for two bags. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, I think I still have like five dollar rewards on my Walgreens number, my phone number. And I gotta keep some money on my boats because if I get out, I gotta be able to be able to put the money on on a card, and then I can use that to go get like a um, phone or something, so I can have something to call you guys. Yeah. Hopefully, hopefully, I can still have my same number. I don't know. Cause I, I got like twenty dollars on there for the phone for here. Mm. Uh, I don't know. Damn! I hope Stephanie writes me back. I can check it if we're done talking. I guess. Yeah, she probably. If she didn't, she probably. She probably still at the court or whatever. She probably uh right after dinner. I don't know. A lot of times she's all right till later at night, too. Yeah, because she usually is in bed till dinner. And then the computer goes off from 2.30 to 4.30, so she goes on after that. Well, hopefully he gets some damn Harry Potter books and we'll give him something to do, because I'm almost done with book number four. I'm about to get five and six here, probably Monday. Yeah. Probably 200 pages left. But once I get out, I want to order some the actual books, like, because I was re looking in the back of the book, and it says that there's a collectible set, and it comes with three other books. Mm. Yeah. I don't know. I suppose I'll let you go, but, uh, yeah, I'm going to call back tomorrow at 5 to talk to Johnny. Maybe not. He can, go, he can step outside and talk to me, little punk ass. Mm-hmm. All right, I love you. Love you too. All right, no. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number followed. <laughs> one moment, one moment for collect call. Please dial zero. Plus the area. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $23.53. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press this call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Good morning. You're up. What? You're up. 
Yeah, you kind of just read it. Just got out of the shower. <laughs> What? So that money's on there that I'm guessing? How you know? Because I had 300 on my books. It would only let me do 300. It wouldn't let me do 450. It said you certificate can only spend $300 a week. So it only let me put 300. And it wouldn't let me do it now. Why? I don't know. It said the card needs reviewing. Wow. Well, Maybe because you just did 300 on mine? Huh? I did that one first, then I did L, so... Hey, maybe because you just spent 300 so give All Right. ...tomorrow or something. Um, I was going to say... Yeah, I wonder if it'll... Did you have to set up a PIN number? Yeah. Okay, because I'll say, are you going to go to the ATM to get money out? Probably not today. I don't know. I'll have to work until next Wednesday now, so... Or next Tuesday of all, so maybe next week I run into town, I don't know. Yeah. I can still take it off my card on Saturday, but I won't be able to get to town until next Wednesday. Yeah, yeah, because then you can, like I said, you can send uh, him that biggie and then her the sweet eats one. Yeah. And mine won't be available until after the 8th. They have a new one on there anyway. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They're stupid because it only lets you spend a hundred a week. So why did why did they only let you do three hundred? That's dumb. Huh. No, it said on there that the recipient can only spend three hundred a week. That's a lie. So, so I don't know. And that video thing is not set up on your on at that location yet. So I looked. Yeah, that's somebody else said that they're having problems. But I was going to say that the kiosks are off from 2.30 to 4.30 anyway, so we'd have to figure out a time to do it anyway. If they automatically right. take them off. And I'm like, if you schedule it at 3, then it's not going to work. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I added 20 on there, like you said. Yeah, mm -hmm. said that. Probably because you just added 300 and it takes a minute or something, so I would just try it tomorrow and see. Yeah, because it was 330 actually, because it charged you $30 for your 300 yeah, well, I tried to put three or four fifty on there. It would have been four hundred ninety five. Oh, me that ain't terrible. Damn, that's crazy. Yeah, well, it charged you ten dollars about a uh, hundred. <clears throat> right. Well, if nothing else, just put a little bit on there at a time. You know what I mean? But then it's still gonna add up. Right. That's why I said do one big amount. That way you don't have to pay one fee. You know what I mean? Right. So, I mean, the 300 should last a couple weeks anyway, three weeks, whatever. Right. Um, uh, actually, I don't even have to go to an ATM. I can just leave that money on the card and I can just use your card for to pay for that. Pay for you know what I mean? Whatever you need. Yeah. For his eye care and her eye care. Well, it wouldn't work, I thought you said. They said my card wouldn't work. I mean, when I do. Yeah, because you have to use your card. Yeah, to see I still have your card to fall back on. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I didn't know if you needed the money. No, I can just use your card like I would my own. Yeah. You know. I just didn't know if some things wouldn't let you use it. Well, it doesn't let me use your card, but I can use my card, and then what you owe me, I can take off and use your card. You know what I'm saying? Instead of having cash. If you're going to use it to pay a bill or something, we'll let you use that card. Chose. Oh, I don't pay bills. Yeah, yeah, you can. Oh, he pays all the bills. What? I said, yeah, you can use it. That's easier. I was going to say, it would be easier for you to get the cash out or just to use the card. Yeah, for me it's just easier for the card because I don't like carrying cash. Because then I want to spend it more faster, you know. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, I got cash. I'm gonna go buy this, buy that. You know, if I got the card, it, it lasts longer. Right. So you like those pads better? You've been using those pads? 
Yeah, I've been using them. I got a tote full downstairs. I got like five, one, five. I got like eight I kept up here. Or no. And I think eleven, eleven that I kept up here, and then I took a big tote full downstairs. Well, that's just odd. Eleven. <laughs> I think it came with twenty. Oh yeah, because. Well, I know, but we used two in the bathroom, two in the living room, and one in Fuzzy's room. So that's an odd number. <laughs> five. Yeah, but then I kept when I have those in the washing machine. I need five to put down. Right, so that's ten. Where do you get eleven from? I I just kept an extra one up just in case I had to change one. Yeah, they they come in handy though, don't they? Save you money. Oh yeah. I mean, I paid yeah, but now it's hard to find bleach to keep them bleached. No. Every no. every time I find bleach, I just told you about this. Um, huh. I had a whole bunch of doubt Larry grab it. It's called. You should look it up on Amazon. You should order you some. I mean, you can get it from like uh, um, what do you call it? Like the hardware store and stuff. It's called. Odo band, O D O B A N. You get a big gallon of it. You put a little bit in the laundry. It takes the, the year out. You can use it for cleaning. You can use it for What's it called? O B. No, O D O. O D O B A N. It's only like five dollars a gallon, but if you can use it for everything. I use it to mop my floors, wipe the kitchen. The O D O D A N. Ban, B A N. Like older band. B A N. B A N, yep. It's called mm. Odo Band. And it's it's some high quality shit. You can get it at like Lowe's or Home Depot. But you can also get it off Amazon. I, that's where I bought it from. Um, but it's like five, six dollars a gallon. But if you use it for cleaning, you dump it in like a little bit in a spray bottle, not even a lot, lot. Because one gallon makes 32 gallons. You know, I'm putting a little spray bottle and adds water to it, and you can use it for cleaning your whole house down. It kills, it kills, it's better than bleach, but it smells better. They have, like, lavender mm-hmm. scented, but I just get the original. But it, it kills germs. It's, it's amazing shit. You dump it, you can put it in your laundry with your clothes. I didn't, I just put it in with the pads because it made it take that uh, urine smell out. Well, how much you put in? Just, just a tiny dab? You know, you know that little cap thing where the bleach thing is at? Yeah. I fill that up, and sometimes I just sprawl, sprawl a little bit around, around the pads, seeing how bad they are. But, yeah. Or, um, yeah, it, it depends on how bad it is. I'll just throw some in there. But it, it's some good ass shit, though. I bought like yeah. eight of them. It's so to grab them. <laughs> they're, they're under mm-hmm. the dining room. With a couple gallons left. But yeah, I use I use it to mop my floors and everything, clean my house. We use it for mm-hmm. It tells you everything you use it for. The wash. Because I used it at one of my jobs that I worked at. Mm-hmm. Use it for anything and everything. You can use it as an air freshener. <laughs> That's how fucking crazy it is. Like you put it in a spray bottle mm-hmm. or whatever. Yeah. All right. Spray it on my couch and stuff. Made it smell good. Yeah. That smell out. It, do, it doesn't, like, bleach your clothes or anything? Nope. Like I said, I got a... I use the original. I, I haven't had a chance to try the lavender yet. I, I have a feeling it probably smells good. I just use the original just to take the smell out. Lavender probably would be a good lavender. Yeah. Yeah, if you have... like when Josiah was working on his potty training and I did him one time I let him go to bed with his nap time with no pull up on he did real good didn't even pee but one time he did and I had used that on his clothes to wash them and it took the urine from him mm-hmm. yeah you should definitely look that up and order you some what? I think it's like six dollars or something like that it ain't even that bad at all I think I ordered like four of them at a time. Just because I used them yeah. for everything. For cleaning. Yeah. Because I was washing pads every day. So yeah, pads. sometimes I do too. It all depends. Yeah. <coughs> well, so you said you order them eye cares on Saturday morning? She'll get her Saturday. Yeah. I'm thinking. Yeah. 
Well, I can do it Saturday. Well, I got to work Sunday, so I'll probably do it either Saturday morning, probably Saturday morning, because I have to work at 10 on Sunday, so. Um, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'm usually up early so I can do it like right away. Yeah, order those on Saturday. I would try it. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if you want to try it later. I mean, you can try it tomorrow. He just had his. He gets his. Yeah, but I already got two of them on there saying that they're re reviewing them, so hopefully they both don't go through, because if they do, then. Uh, then he'll have six hundred dollars on his fucking card, so I'm not going to do it again until I figure. Wait a minute, and I'll let I'll let you know if we're through or not. Through. Well, it'll let me know on the card. <clears throat> yeah, I'll say I would wait and see if it goes through or not, because he doesn't get commentary till you said Tuesday, so he'll probably get to Tuesdays and Fridays. Today's only Wednesday, and he if he gets that biggie on Saturday, he'll be fine for for a minute. He just ordered a whole bunch of shit, plus he'll get that biggie on Saturday, so he'll be good for, for a little bit, so we have time to figure it out. Alright. Mm -hmm. I ain't too worried about it. What? I said I'm not too worried about it right now, because he just had, he just ordered a hundred dollars worth of shit, plus he's got that. Right. So he's good on food. I mean, he probably can yeah. hygiene or whatever, and hair care stuff, but he can get that for Tuesday if he has to. Yeah. Alright, well, I'm going to try to be here soon. Alright. Oh, but, uh, you know, I'll probably call you later tonight then. Okay. Alright, love you. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Hey! Huh? Not too late, because I don't have to work today, so you can call me before 8, because I'll be. Alright. <laughs> I would do. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. One moment. One moment. For a collect call, press 1. To place a call using, please enter the PIN number located on the calling card. The current balance for that card is sixteen dollars sixteen cents. Press one to play. Please enter the ten-digit number you wish to. Hello, this is a prepaid call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presiones 2. To accept this call. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? Hello, what are you doing? Hey, can you hear me? I actually can. You sound well rested. Ah, I am well rested. Yes. No, I got this out right now. So. How's your vagina feeling today? Oh, it's still hurting. I didn't want to do it all. I think I got some anal leakage going on. You got what? I think I got anal leakage going on. Oh, God. <laughs> no. Do you need a... Do you, do you I need it. a... Daddy, turn it down. Okay, but you're here. Okay. Yeah, I think you're bringing the medical book. You, um, still with your dad? Can you hear me? Oh, it's too... I don't want to have my head on Okay, hello? Yeah? Yeah. Oh, can you hear me now? I, I can. The first. Oh, okay, I got the, got the headphones in now. All right. Yeah. Are you still with your dad? So, yeah, um, we're going to, uh, oh, we're going, hello? Yes. Oh, wow, I'm going to hold the phone, that's next. Um, yeah, so we're going to, um, I'm going to go see, I'm going to drop the stuff out to John right now.
You're going to drop what off? Some stuff. Some stuff? Okay. Yeah, she wants to see Sarah and Barbie dolls and stuff. That's going to drop it off to her. Hey, I don't know what you're saying. What is it? I think I need to speak to your father. You do what now? What is, what, why can't I ever hear you? understand you. I don't fucking speak know. Speak too fast. It's, speak too fast. It's, it's fucking, it's probably I'm speak too fast. Probably because you're spinning. I'm not spinning. I took a nap. <laughs> you're not spinning. You took a nap. You're nervous. I took a nap. <laughs> Okay, what picture did she send you? Now that I can hear you, what picture did she send you? Oh, um... Yeah, pull in the leaf stick right here. Pull in the leaf stick right here. Because I'm ordering something to drink or something. Because I want something now. Um, so... Um, I feel like it was a good piece of bunch of them, actually. You want me to, um... She said she sent, like, eight of them. She's like, is that enough? I said, well, that's... Think so? Yeah, it's plenty. Uh, I'm trying to. Oh, I want uh, a three-piece chicken strip set. I said I think I'm going in. Going to make a collage. Yeah, I do. I'm going to make a collage, and um, I bought a. Uh, yeah, I bought a. Uh, I'm going to make like a collage thing for you, and then uh, I'm going to I think put some pictures in a uh, frame. I'm right behind you. Uh, yeah. Like, uh, it's like a frame, like an actual picture frame, you know, with, oh, like, multiple frames like, uh, in it. Like the collage app on your phone? No, like, I bought a frame. Oh, you bought a frame. But yeah, can, and I have, like, You can, um, what you could do, I'm going to tell you how to make it cheaper. If you download the I know collage I'm... app on your phone, you can make the collage on your phone, and then print it off as one photo. Not, uh, yeah, but I have a collage app on my phone. You can play with it. Just do frames and all that stuff. Okay. Sorry, uh, macaroni and cheese uh, and macaroni and gravy. And, okay, so I have the yeah, I mean, I don't have that app exactly, but I have um, an app like it. Oh. But I'm going to do it on my laptop. Oh. And then uh, send them to my phone. Yeah, so they, um, they turn out really good. So, but if you want to um, video on my laptop, I can, uh, I'm trying to figure out which flash player I have to download on the laptop. Okay. Yeah, I just, I had, I just, yeah, I just had my dad go to the bank, so, uh, I was going to get my nails done, but I'm just going to say, fuck it, I'm going to order you an iPhone and stuff instead. Why? Because, uh, so we already talked about this. To, I don't care what we talked about. <laughs> You know, I like that song that you sang. Did you, um, okay, yeah, did you get the, all the lyrics? Yes, I did. And I said, damn, this is like my life to a T. I know, that's why, um, I know, that's why I freaking said it. Yeah. Right, that's, that's crazy. I know, I said, oh my God, this is for Amanda. This is so for Amanda Lee right now. Most definitely. I've been listening to music no. forever, so it definitely fits. Perfectly. I know. Back. Yeah, I'm at Lee's. You're at Lee's? Yeah, I'm over at Lee's. You know, over here by uh, Toy Street? The Lee's over at Toy Street? Oh, um. No, I don't know where First Street's at. I'm not from here. Oh. Uh, uh, is, that I, I don't you, is, that, is that the corner that you work on? First yeah, yeah. Oh, no, that was 3rd of Maine. That was 3rd of Maine, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. I know. I'm just working over here right now. Part, I'm just trying to couple, get a couple dollars so I go to the honest house, you know. And uh, then I'm going to my I real job. I'm going to go to the real corner. I'm going to go to the real corner where the words, all the money's at. Right, right. Exactly. Right, right. <laughs> That's why you're trying to get I'm trying to get you. <laughs> yeah, I'm working way too hard out here. It's hard out here for a camp. Oh, God. This is Hector <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got all these extra clients so I don't know what to do them all. Oh, God. Hmm. I miss you, dude. I miss you, too. That's crazy. No. I had a photo. Oh, so these pictures, uh, there are a few of them that I like a lot that um, I really do. I think they look really beautiful on them. I'm about to tell you what they are. Um, let's see. Um, 
There's one of you in your little Nissan swing. Oh my God, there's one of you and a little baby in like red out, like red checkered outfits. I feel like it's the holiday season. I'm not sure which one she's saying. Oh That's my God. Said, hurry up and make this collage so I can see what pictures she sent you. Yeah, there's one. Many pictures. Um, I don't. Oh, of yourself? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, I don't there's just one of you on the gun. I don't, um, like my picture taken, so I... I don't know oh, if you're going to oh, let me... Oh, are you talking about the big, like, the big black AR? Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to let me send that, that one. I don't like that one. That's my brother's gun. You don't? No, you can't send that uh, one to me. They're going to deny it because it's got a gun in it. And there's a picture of you on the lake in, like, a blue hoodie. Send one to like, a lot. I can't remember. Yeah. You're in a blue hoodie and, uh, like a camo hat. Your eyes are, like, super, super blue. Are we on the boat? Yes, yeah, on the boat. Oh, am I wearing my mom's hat? Maybe. It's, is it the pink and camo? Yep. I remember that. Day. Yeah. That was just in September. Why is that? When I went up there. Yeah, you know, when I told, um, when I left L for them 10 days, remember? No, you yeah. I went up there. That was in September. Oh, I got to ride my... I feel like, uh, I want to get on, you know, I've never been on a boat my whole life. Look, we are going to go snowmobiling and four-wheeling and boating and we're going to have yeah. a blast. I'm telling you. I've never, I've never done any of shit. You're going to live, my friend. And then you're going to ride a glittered unicorn. I know, I can't wait. I told my mom about that. She said, oh my God, are you sure you want to be here, friend? <laughs> I said it's fine. So I'll, I'll make it happen for her. I'll set. I'll, I'll. I'll get some glitter. Spray glitter. Is and, Abby? Um. Is Abby still talk to your brother? Your one brother? Well, I kind of shut that down a little bit. Yeah, because I don't want her to hurt him. Yeah, he's all sensitive. Yeah, I don't want her to hurt him. He's young and never been in a relationship. And he, you know what I mean? I know. I don't want. I just trying to try to look out for my brother. And she's, um, she's a what for what? Yeah, she's already got a new one. <laughs> Who is it? Week. I don't know. Oh, she doesn't, oh, um, she's already got a new bitch in there? That's what I'm saying. It's, it's huh. a different one every week, so. I know, man. It's fine. But, but she braided can... my hair, and she braided my hair, and she's like, Abby, who braided your hair? I said, well, I used to have this one girl named Abby braid my hair, but she don't braid my hair anymore. She knew um, that one girl. That's why I liked when you were here, because she braided my hair. I don't even know I suck at it. I'm not good at breathing. No, it was good. It was good. I liked it. <laughs> yeah, and then I got to the end. Who's over there in uh, South before? Nobody important? I don't know. Oh, Hold on. How's Sean doing? I'm on the phone again. I'm not sexy, Gary. What are you doing? Nothing? It's what hurt, motherfucker. <laughs> Nothing working. <laughs> I don't know what it is, bitch. You need to add me on the kiosk. Oh, okay, yeah. What, what's your last name? What uh, about Bird, B-Y-R-D. Oh. oh, yeah, I knew that. Yeah. Will you do that, like, ASAP? Uh-huh. I'll do right now. Okay, all right, I gotta go. All right, Hello? have a good day. Love you. Hello? Yeah. She what's you to walk on the phone? Oh, God, Abby. I didn't even see Abby right there. Ever, do you want to say hi to Danny? No. <laughs> she said no. <laughs> oh, God. So did I. Fine. He's mad. These phone calls aren't free. He's mad because Jack don't come to the window for one on one. No, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, it's I fine. Know. It'll be fine. What have you do this? You don't want to talk about him? Do I what? How does you leave what's up? Can't go be in that pod. In the pod? What are you talking about? Heather Bird? She was coming in to pick up cherries or whatever the server. I know, I said that's illegal as fuck. So she was? I said that's illegal as fuck. Mm. Um, Who's yeah. working right now? Who's working? Uh, it's Miss Floyd and I think Miss S is assisting. I'm mad at Miss uh, S. She went and gave me my hair cutting kit yesterday. I'm mad at her. Who's gonna cut your hair? Yeah, he was going to cut my hair. But I don't know about now. She's mad at me. Why? Because uh, I offered her to say hi to you and not her. 
Oh, my God. I didn't want to talk to her anyway. I said no. Fine. He said I said no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'm serious. I know. I know. I'm She's just too much, man. Everything I tell her, she's supposed to be around. Fuck that, bitch. I don't know. Why do you do that? Makes you like, it makes you not even want to be her friend. I know. So my mom That's said you have to text her. How, how, much did, how much did my mom say you have to text her? She said she texts me every day a couple times a day. <laughs> I said, That's, That's fine. I'll text her right back. That's a bit excessive, mother. I'm about to text him and be like, you didn't text me back, lady. Well, she, in about an hour. She, she, she told me to tell you that she's working until 6 o'clock oh, her yeah. time. Oh, 6 o'clock her five, time. Five o'clock, 5 o'clock her time, 6 o'clock her time. Oh, wow. She should be home at 6 o'clock. She's off at 6, but it's 5 our time. I didn't know it was constantly like that. I thought we were all in the same, at, all in the same atmosphere. So you oh, time, hit, oh. um, like, the time change is in Illinois. Oh, really? Yeah, right right before Chicago. That's what the time I asked you, I said, today's a safe doctor later. I used to, <laughs> I used to have it, like, down, pinpointed, like, oh, the yeah. exact spot. When I drive, I'm like, okay, time change is about to happen. Does the time change fuck you up, like, when you go from here to there? No, it's just an hour. It doesn't really bother me. How far is LA? How far does it take? Like, how much time zone is out? It takes me eight hours to get there. I mean, like, what's the time? Like, is, it, is there a time difference? Because that's across the world. Is there, like, a time difference from us? Oh. Like, if, if I leave at 12 o'clock here, I'll get there at, like, 7 o'clock. Oh, yeah. there. But it'd be 8 o'clock here, if that makes sense. She said no. So they're just an hour. So they said no. they're an hour behind. Huh? Are they an hour behind? Or 7? Um. Okay, I just got distracted. Abby said, now I can say hi. No, you can't say hi the first time, fuck you. I already told her you Maybe. said no. Um, I feel like, so what state, what's the longest time thing, time gap there is? You said what's the longest what? Time gap, like, uh, what's the, like, um, like, like, like what's the longest, like, if we are, whatever time, what's the long, like, what state is the longest time different, I guess? Uh, Alaska? 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 I don't know. You act like I have Google or something. Oh, yeah. That's right. I do, though. <laughs> I don't Google it. <laughs> You're insane. Hmm. Okay, so I sent that letter out this morning. Okay. So be watching for it. And I sent it to her, her house, so... Okay, I'll be watching. I'll be there and when I leave the office, I'm going there. You'll probably get it... I'm gonna, I'll be surprised if you get it tomorrow. Yeah, uh, why? Because it's so early this morning. Because it's only fucking right up the road. Like, it's literally only two minutes from the jail. I know. Yeah. So, I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, yeah, there's only 29? What? Heather's only 29? Let's see, like... Who, Heather? Yeah, her. I didn't know that. That's how old I am. Yeah, last time we was out there, I feel like you were in the biggest pack in the world. Hmm. What? She got some big boy charges too, don't she? Like F1? Um, she got some about four F1s, and um, they gave her 15, and she said, I fucked you on a house. She said, what? She said, she want a house arrest. Hmm. I don't know how she got Yeah, they came out. With four F1s, that's um, good. Same. Same. I don't know, because there's kidnapping. That's why she was like, I don't understand why you're going to be a worker. Because she's like, I'm going to go for kidnapping charges. Because I have one of those charges, too. I have F1 kidnapping. Yeah, well, she's got four. So that doesn't make any sense. I'm... Fucking that jail sucks balls. That's why. Her number is 5899. Five, oh, that's her inmate number? That's hers, yeah. yeah. I think that's why she's bad, because you talk to her, not her. Whatever, I don't care. She'll get over it. Whatever, though. I know Bird from home, though. So I don't know she's been mad at me since you left. For real. Well, I don't know. She, she's like, I, she told me the other day, she said, I'm worried about you. I'm like, why? She said, I don't, oh, why? I don't want her to hurt you. I'm like, whatever. 
Oh, I wouldn't have it. No, no, you have to care. You need to care. That's a lot of and the girl is just broke. And then tonight she's like, How many people have said they were going to put money in their books? Blah, 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 blah. I said, A lot of people. I said, But one person has actually came through and actually done it. I said, And that was the end. <laughs> so what, what happened now? I said, Because after she said that the other night, she just said that she was just saying it to get in my head. That she acted like she was worried about me. She didn't want you to hurt me, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, oh, I don't you care now. And then, um, tonight she said, uh, how many people who said they were going to come up here and put money in your books and actually... I did. Oh, they yeah. leave. I said, I said, a lot of people said it. I said, only one came through. I said, that's Amy. I said, I talk to her every day. I said, and she came out and put money in my books, even though I told her not to. Right. Listen, I'm here at Gianna, so I'm going to call you. I'm going to uh, call me back here a little bit. Okay. Uh, I got a free call at, like, quarter to eight. You want me to call you then? All right. Call me, call me then. Okay. All right. Bye. All right. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. <laughs> One moment. One moment. For collect call press. Please dial zero. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $42.17. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press... This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? I just got home. I realized after I called yeah. her, wait, what time is it? I think I called too early. No, well, I just got home, so... How's work? Uh, all right, my heel hurts. I'm just o I just opened your mail. Your utility bill, your light bill, past due was a hundred seventy nine thirty. Well, then they should have let me. Uh, I don't know how. Because I paid, I paid all the bills just before I got locked up, so that's pretty fun. The only one that I, I that should be high is the veteran bill because I only paid fifty on it. The what? The veteran bill, which is the heat and hot water bill. I only put 50 on oh. it. So that's the only one I sold on. The rest should have been paid all the way off. So the invoice for period September 12th to December 11th for your light. Yeah, I already paid payments was zero. Other charges and credits is zero. Yeah, that's the old bill then. It doesn't even say when you last paid it. You can just trash it. It's garbage. What's going? Oh, it's with Johnny. You know, it's an Amish store. Yes. Well, that's scary, but then you got a ta important tax document, huh? Wait, well, you got my tax papers? I don't know. This is an important tax document and clothes. Oh, cause I, I don't know how they expect to do that. I might have to just wait and file them next year because it's going to be too late by time I get out. Probably, because you know, you'll be in there April, April 15th, I think, the last. You do them. Yeah. Like I said, I don't know. I put in the request to see my lawyer for Josiah's case, so hopefully he comes and sees me, like, tomorrow or Monday. Yeah. Like I said, I'm going to give him your name and number and see if they'll allow you to pick him up and take him on a state. I don't, I don't know. I'd rather have him with you, like I said, than anybody else. 
Yeah. And he's like, well, who would watch him? I said, well, James. <laughs> I mean, he's, he's potty trained. He, he, if you turn on Netflix, he's good. He, his iPad. He, they'll let you know when he's hungry. <laughs> he'll be like, eat, eat. He always says, eat, eat. Fuzzy can sit there and watch TV. He likes Fuzzy. Fuzzy's his buddy. Because <laughs> 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 when, when I, Josiah was eating lunch, and he was video chatting with, with Fuzzy and he made me put the iPad at the table, and he ate lunch with him. <laughs> the whole time. And every time I went to go take my phone back, because I went to the bathroom, so I set it down by Jojo. And Jojo, he wouldn't let me take the phone back. <laughs> He's mad. He's like, uh-uh. He wanted to talk yeah. to me. Fuzzy. <laughs> yeah. Well. Yeah, I don't know what's so. <laughs> Oh, yeah, Je- I heard it. I got a message from Jenny, and she said, I would have called, but we got in trouble, so we had to sit on our beds from God knows for, for a long time. So that's what happens. We got, like, 60 people in here. They're all, they're so loud. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and that's crazy, because when they opened the door at 3.30, or around 2.30, yeah, it was around 2.30 when we got our commissary. <laughs> and the, there, our doors are right next to each other, so the CO from... <coughs> Where Jenny's at, opened the door to watch, you know, her hand us her stuff. <laughs> and she, she yelled, she's like, all right, ladies, you got 10 minutes until you're being bunked. I'm like, damn, they, they're always getting bunked. Mm-hmm. Right? I'm like, Jenny's probably over there like, what the hell? Is this? That was it today, too? Every day they have to get bunked okay. for certain times. It's crazy because I'm next door where we don't have a CO, and you have to, like, beg for hours for toilet paper. Like, they just forget about us over here. We pretty, they call this the princess pod, because we just do whatever we want, basically. <laughs> as long as we have toilet paper. Like wipe your ass. And pads, and we're good. As long as they're not dying, then they don't care. Right. That's the one Jenny should have been in. Yes and no, because of her mental health, she wouldn't be able to be over here with everybody when nobody can watch her. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Me, I'm, I can take care of myself, you know. Like if I feel like I'm at harm, I can just push the button and ask to be moved. But her, she wouldn't. She would just take it. Yeah, if they answer it. Right. You could be bleeding to death and make what time time you until you're dead. What time I push the button? Because I think I asked for toilet paper or something. He said, go take a nap. I was pissed. I was like, are you fucking serious? He hung up. He said, go take a nap. I'm like, damn, we need some ass wipe. That's all you fucking do. All you have to do is nap in there, it seems like. That's it. <laughs> Eat or sleep. There's a TV Or problem, shit. But, but really wrong Eat, sleep, and shit. So you said that, I was trying to watch the news today, but it's, it's not on there right now. <clears throat> but you said that they said, you were reading it, and they said that they didn't read my rights, and they didn't have a search warrant, is that we said? Yeah. I thought that's what you said. There was nothing else on there? Uh-uh. This one, you have to go back to court again. Mm, yeah, March 20th. Yeah. So Jenny has court on uh, Wednesday, right? The 29th? Probably. Yeah. You know, too. I did yeah, not have to go to the court. It was fucked up. There was, like, probably, like, six men, and they went, they went first, and there were probably, like, there was three of us women who... They handcuffed us all together. I was in the middle. Mm. Like, of course. <laughs> <laughs> then there's four other women behind us that were handcuffed together. I'm like, I said, I'd rather have three of us than four. But damn, mm. I don't like being handcuffed to another person. It's fucking weird. I don't know, right? Mm. I don't think I'll run. Right. You're going with them. <laughs> I think that the next court date I go to, I might be by myself. And I think it's more or less about my case because it's at 9 a.m. Mm. <laughs> it could take hours, I guess. <laughs> but I uh, I sent a message on the kiosk the computer for you and uh, did you get to go on my phone probably not you just got home huh? uh, yeah I just got home okay. well, he was happy to up so. well cause I I told him I spent all my money cause I bought me a t-shirt cause it's fucking cold you should ask Jenny if she needs any like socks or underwear or stuff yeah like she that. just messaged me or she messaged me earlier but I couldn't I couldn't get enough internet work to message but she said she needs socks so she needs a little bit of money on her thing to buy some socks because they've been getting cold for like four days and 
they won't give us an extra blanket. Even though it was on the news, and they said they gave us an extra blanket, but they said they don't have enough for everybody, so we didn't get one. So mm. we had to freeze all day. So I bought a t-shirt and a pair of boxers. Mm. <clears throat> and their socks are only like three bucks. The underwear is like three bucks. I don't know if she needs any. No, she just said she's been... So a couple pairs of socks to wear to get a hole in them, so she needs a couple more. Okay, yeah, because she should have got a pair of fuzzy socks from a uh, Christmas package. Yeah, but I don't know if she even, I don't know if she came in with socks or not. <laughs> Probably not, no one's <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't, I was thinking about it, I don't think she wore socks in here, so she probably just had that one pair, so yeah, she probably needs, probably can get a couple pairs for her. Yeah. And if she needs underwear, it's probably that they run a little bit smaller, so. Yeah, my sense are not so underwear, because she's used to not wearing underwear anyway. Well, yeah, but, it, it, I mean, if it comes that time of the month, she's going to need to wear underwear. I guess she has a toilet paper. You know. <laughs> you know I said, hello, I just see you. That's what she used last time. Oh. Well, they have pads here. That's all they give us. On a minute. Well, at least she's getting on the computer now and stuff, so. Yeah. Oh. You said they went to where? The Amish store? Yeah, they weren't here when I got here, so I don't know what to do. <laughs> well, if Johnny comes in, tell him to check his messages. <laughs> who was that? What? Somebody was speaking in the door. I was trying to figure out who it was. <laughs> you <are quiet. laughs> yeah. Um, it was probably meds or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. That's yeah, gonna be you, too. Johnny, do you think Johnny will come in? I don't have no idea. Well, if he does, tell him that I said to check his messages. Alright. Well, I'll let you go. I just wanted to see if, uh... Don't forget to go on there and try to send that picture. Uh... And I'll just be waiting for the message back. Hopefully the message is back. Well, I might have to wait until I get paid again because... I ain't get, we ain't got a whole lot of credits left. I'll see what I got for credits because if I have to put 20 on her thing, and I, I don't get, well, I get paid we tomorrow, get but it ain't going to be in Because we don't get commentary again until Tuesday, so, or no, until mo Monday. So you don't, I mean, you don't have to worry about putting money on our books until like Sunday. Mm hmm. Yes, I mean, what is today, Friday? Thursday? Okay. Yes, it's Thursday, so when do you get paid again, Saturday? No, well, I get paid tomorrow, so it won't be in there until Saturday. Oh, well, that's fine. Tomorrow is Friday. Yeah. You said you get paid Friday, but it won't be in there until tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow is Friday. Whatever. I had a long day. I didn't sleep very good both nights. Well, that way, if you that way, you get money on the phone or kiosk or whatever tell you so you need to and then after you get paid you can put her on her because she can't put her order in until Sunday anyway or whatever she needs because it's like I said make sure you let her know that they if she orders underwear or anything that they go run bigger and it, I ordered me a t-shirt I went out the size I got a 2x so I don't know if she wants a 2x or a 3x the 2x is a little big on me but she might want like 3 or something just to be comfy T-shirt yeah. like Everything here is Bob Barker. <laughs> it is Bob Barker underwear and T-shirts and thermals and soap. It's Bob Barker. <laughs> Some shit. Mm. Mm. He probably donates all that money and shit. Probably something. All for Bob Barker. Mm-hmm. Mm. All right. You're waiting for uh, the computer, then. You what? So I'll just be waiting around for the computer for you to send me my messages. All right, I'll look, see what we got. I'm late. Tell us you love him. All right, you'll call me tomorrow night, then? Yeah, I will. And tell Johnny to check his messages. 
so great. <laughs> Love you. Love you too. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID now. <laughs> one moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Press... <laughs> Hello, this is a collect call from... An inmate at... Montgomery County Jail, with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presiones 2. The current balance for your account is $6.55. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. Good luck. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? <clears throat> my uh, message? Yeah. Oh, okay. I wasn't sure because you never messaged me back, so... Oh, uh, well, we only got 200 credits, so I'm kind of... Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I'll be putting more on tomorrow, but... Okay, that's fine. Um, yeah, I just because you know, he said he called Monday or something. I'm like, oh, well, it's two this morning, so. Fine. Well, my phone don't tell me when I have messages, so every now and then I just think to check, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, you should check probably like every day or something just in case you know, anybody calls you that. But he did say try to call down Montgomery County and show services and tell them who you are and that you're trying to get in and, or whatever to see what you have to do. Cause that's yeah. Because I put in a, a request to see my my other lawyer for Josiah, and hopefully, hopefully he comes next. I'm hoping Monday or something, so he can tell me how court went or whatever or something. But yeah, that's all I'm waiting on. So yeah. So what did your lawyer have to say? He said he didn't have no new news or whatever. No, he, he just doing a check out. That's all. And, I mean, I, I couldn't no. say anything on the phone anyway because they listened to it. No. All right. Well, that's what he said on the message, but... No, they must say read the messages, too. Yeah, I'm sure they do. Yeah. So I can't really, like... The only thing I can do is write you a handwritten letter, because they, they can't read that, but... If anything... Um, he no. just came in and told me what was on the news yesterday, so... Oh. Um. Just trying to check on me and all that. All right. How much money was on the phone? Mm, it was eight when I talked to Jenny, and then it was six something. My answer for you. Well, I figured I'd jump on the phone. It was empty because everybody's in line for meds. <clears throat> I put in a request to go to the dentist. I don't know if they're going to charge me six bucks or not because I have to have to take one of my my tooth out because it's bothering me. No. They're probably yeah. waiting until they get money on my books to charge me for it. What did Jenny want? Or what, how's she doing? She's doing good. No, she's chatted for a little bit. She seems to be doing all right. She can't sleep. Me neither. I can't either because where my bed's at. I go like four or five days without sleeping. Plus, I got a lot on my mind. It's hard to sleep here. No. Yeah. But I was going to ask you for a favor, but I'm pretty sure you're probably saying no. What? Because I know you're you're putting a hundred on my books, right? For the two weeks. That's what you wanted. Well, you, that way I could spend fifty a week and make in because it comes twice a week. I could spend twenty five each time and it would last. Because I got to right. get personal stuff too. And that you know, I was going to ask you about a fresh flavor if you send me my friend one. She doesn't get anything. What? I said I was trying. I was going to ask you if you could send me and my friend a fresh flavor because she doesn't get anything and. She I don't know. It depends on what I have left. Okay. I'm going to put it on the phone and, you know, you and Jenny. And have you put it, like, send it to her name just to make her feel like she gets something. Feel bad. Yeah. Or does it 
get any food. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. Send me the info. I'll, I'll send it to you in a message, her name and what we want. Okay? But you, you yeah. Know. All I need is her last name. All you need is her last name? Well, I'll send it to you. Yeah. Name. Well, yeah, you better do me the first, too, because that way, when it looks yeah. it up, make sure it's the right person. I'll give you your armband number, too, just in case. I mean, I didn't... Okay. But you don't never yeah. need to do you just need the name, right? Yeah, just go your last name, and then it looks it up, and then it says, is this the person you're looking for? And then you push yes. Or go on, push that person's name. Well, just because I'm, I'm going to have you order, if you order each one... Uh, um, then we can share it. Like if you order one that comes with the wings, like if you order a pizza and wings, and then just the pizza, we're gonna share it all. You know what I mean? Me and her are gonna share it. We're gonna split the wings and all that. Just explain that into the message. Whatever you want. I'm, Whatever. I'm, what is it? I'm, she's sleeping. She's sick right now. We're on our second warning, so. Can you yell at us right now? Can you hear? Her? Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna yell that. So that's why I thought I'd tell you now because the next time we get bumped. <laughs> Two warnings there. Mm -hmm. Just got my hair braided. Right. I was in the yeah. middle. Hair braided when my lawyer came. Mm. Yeah, I'll, when she gets up or whatever, I'll probably, we'll go look through the list tomorrow or something and pick out what we want. So. Right. She, uh, she, her, her boyfriend gets out of a program at the end of next month and he, he'll uh, put some money on her books for her. So I'll just, you know, try to help her out until then. Yeah. All right. I love you, and so, and I'll message you probably in the morning or something, or sometime tomorrow. Nah, yeah, I get done. I should be home. Walk forward. Okay. Right. I love you. Love you too. Right. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your person. One moment, one moment, for collect call press 1. Please dial 0. Hello, this is a free call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? Yeah, I tried to call you off someone else's number, but uh, this is a free call, I guess. I need you to write this down. What? You got a pen and paper? For what? Well, hopefully I don't lose you. Set the phone down. Huh? Well, set the phone down and we'll get some pen and paper. <clears throat> All right. P-U-A. Hold on. P-U-A. Unemployment. P-U-A. P-U-A. Yeah. Unemployment. Yeah. Ohio. Dot gov. You got, you got it? It's D-U-A or, or P-U-A? P. P as in poop? Yes. Okay. Yes. Why? All right, so I need you to go to the website and I need you to fill that out for me. But I need you to write down, okay, so write down um, date for March. Back date for March. She said that once you um, backdate it for March, okay, so when you go on there, it's going to ask you, like, four questions, four, like, security questions. What color 
on my eyes, on my driver license and shit like that. If you don't know, just, just message me and I'll message you or whatever. But unless you do it now, I don't know. But she said if you um back it from March, if Windows uh, there's gonna be a pop up screen that comes back saying that uh saying that uh about a date. I don't know, you should be able to figure it out. But it's basically unemployment for Ohio because we're in a red zone and shit like that. But I should be able to get like seven thousand back. If you back it for March. Yeah, but they'll put that in your checking code, and that's how we already... No, they'll, they'll send you a card, like an SN card. It'll be a black card. How do you know all this? Because everybody is doing it. Everybody that's in jail? Yes. That's where we're all going to hear from. They didn't let me out. All right. I mean, if you want to, I don't know if you want to... Where's this, is James near you? He's cooking, or he's messing with food right now. Oh. Um, I was going to say, just uh, do it while I'm on the phone with you, but you can't, can you? No, they're probably not even open now. They can only do it a certain time of the day, and it's only on Sundays. No. Sundays or Monday. It's different. Oh. This, this ain't, like, the unemployment shit like that. This is, like, a one-time thing. Um. Well, I'll see what I can do. Well, this is a free call, so I'll set to call you Wednesday after uh after I get back from court or something, probably after dinner. I got court Wednesday at two, so no. Yeah. Yeah. Um, he said fuzzy mess with food. Yeah, he's cooking hot dogs. Oh my god, he's actually cooking. He's been cooking. What's he cooking them on the grill? Yeah. He just wants to use his new grill, huh? Their hot dog burnt ends. It takes like an hour and a half to cook. What? Why so long? I don't know, because there's a lot of steps you got to do. Oh, my God. That's crazy. <laughs> so, what, are you going to do it tonight, or... I mean, just so I know when to look out for if you have any personal questions. Well, if I have time, I'll do it tonight. Otherwise, I won't have time till Wednesday. Are you in your bedroom? No, I'm out in the kitchen. Oh. All right. Well, like I said, if you have any questions, just message me or whatever. Um, and I'll try to answer them or whatever. All right. Hold on. Yeah, so... Uh, like I said, just message me questions, but it's like she said, it should be four personal questions, like what color are your eyes on your uh, driver license and shit like that. You should know that. <laughs> well, your eyes are blue. Yeah. But I'm saying, that's, it, she says like four questions, and then for, for the back date, put March. He said, but after you put the back date in, the screen's going to pop up. Uh, but will they send it to you being that you're not in Ohio anymore? Yes, just put down, put down um, my address and all that. Remember, because you changed my address. Yeah, so it had it be our address. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Whatever, if you put uh, mailing address or whatever, just put your address. But if you put in uh, all right, address, I'll see what I can do. Address. I gotta make better noodles, so. Okay, just let me know. All right. Love you too. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. For calling car. Please dial 0. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $5.72.
stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. Block all. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hey. Uh, I don't know if Larry's here or not yet. If his phone's on, call Larry and tell him to ask the jail if it's possible that him, Johnny, and Greg can visit me, and then after my visit, visit Jenny. That way I can see my brother and, you know, that way we can see everybody. I tried, I did try calling and he do not answer. Oh, shit. They're probably on the way. Try again or try Fuzzy or something. Try to get a hold of, because if they do that, we're each allowed three visitors at one time. Then three people can come see me in the, for 30 minutes and then turn around and see her for 30 minutes. You know what I mean? Because mm -hmm. we're on, we're both on the same floor. They're not going to let us have visits at the same time. So three people can come see me and then turn around and see her. Tell Larry to ask that. I mean, if you can get a hold of him, try Fuzzy, try Johnny. It, it's worth a try because visits are in 15 minutes, so try to get a hold of somebody. All right. Okay, I love you. If not, uh, I mean, I'll, I'll see you when I see him, but it's worth a try. Yeah. All right, I love you. Oh, I just put 25, I put 25 on your, in your commissary. Okay, thank you. Did you, um... Did I put 50 in Jenny's. I'll let her know tomorrow. Yeah, um... I ain't gonna mess with it tonight anyway. Okay, uh... Damn, I was gonna say that. Did you tell Jenny that they were coming down or visiting her or anything like that? Yeah, so I hope somebody does. Oh, I was, they're gonna say she'd be surprised. Yeah, but, okay. All right. Yeah, try to get a hold of him for me, please. All right. All right, love you. Bye. Yep, bye. Good. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Plus... Hello, this is a collect call from... Hello. Pretty early for And in somebody. the at Montgomery County Jail. With telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Amen. Para Español Presionador. Oh, okay. <laughs> the current balance for your account is... $29.67. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello, you're early tonight. What the hell? You answered. What's going on? You all must be home early. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess. I'm just I'm at home about 3.30. All answers. What? But I, I got bored and I just wanted to see if you'd answer. Mm. My cousin texted me. We haven't. Have messages today. Fuzzy didn't message me. Becky, you dropped Sissy or something. Fuzzy didn't message me. Johnny never messaged me back. I'm getting. Well, oh, you never messaged me, and yeah, you never messaged me anything to send him, and he never messaged anything to send you. Oh, so he's sending no messages. I was waiting to see if he messaged you anything. I guess I can get on there and write him a message. Mine, I heard. Message. I didn't get any messages from anybody today. Only. I'm looking on there in a minute. Do you keep talking away from the phone because I can't hear you? No, I said I'm about to get on the kiosk and write one to him. I didn't know if. I was waiting to see if he had brought me one. Not yet. I just checked a little bit ago, so. Right well, Jody's supposed to try calling again tonight. I sent her, well, I sent her what you told me, so she said she'll try it yeah, again. I don't know if she has a paper or anything, she's worried again or not, but... I don't know. But, uh, I was trying to figure out if it was on the news or whatever. You should go watch the news real quick and see. But, uh, the jailhouse is fucking, the heat is out. It's been out for a couple of days, and they're trying to say it on the news or whatever that it's been out, and... That they gave us extra blankets, but that's a fucking lie. They won't give us an extra blanket. We're not even allowed to use the one we have. They just want us to freeze it. No, that's stupid.
cold as fuck. It's freezing. Well. Act like you're freezing to death in court tomorrow, then maybe they'll give you something. That's what I said. I'm not <laughs> fucking, I put in a grievance, because this shit is, is ridiculous. It's cold as fuck. We can't even sleep. All right. Just change it if my, if my stuff comes on. Are you talking to me or are you talking to them? Because if you're talking oh, to me, then talk to me. I'm talking to both. Well, she said the news was on, and I told her if my case comes on, just change it. No. Because we don't watch the news, because I don't want to watch it. The other right. thing the, 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 the whole jail is out without heat. That's not right. It's, it's freezing. I can't even feel my toes. All right. The workers got to have some way to keep warm, so how are they doing it? They walk around. They got heavier uniforms. They, they got layers on. We literally just sit in one spot. And, uh, mm-hmm. We're not even allowed to use the only blanket we have. They went on the news talking about they gave us extra blankets. No, you didn't. You didn't damn mm-hmm. sure didn't give us extra blanket. You damn sure not even letting us use the one we have. If we do use the one we have, they shut our phones and TVs off. That ain't right. Stupid. It's just a freaking blanket for Christ's sake. Exactly. Feeling fucking dripping water. There's a puddle of water on the floor in two or three spots. There's water mm-hmm. built up in the light. There's black mold all over the damn wall. This place is disgusting health-wise. <laughs> Tell somebody at court the food, tomorrow. The, the food mm-hmm. says not for human consumption. <laughs> yeah, nice. Ah. Yeah, there's milk that's from 2017. I'm like, damn. Yeah, that's gross. Someone said, can you just take me to the Humane Society? Or did you get treated a little better? All right. So, yeah. How are you going to give us milk? At least you get a treat now and then. There. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I saw trying to get John here to send me eye care. I want that snack attack one. It comes with combos and barbettos. It only takes yeah. forever. That's pretty big. Yeah, well, it works all day. I opened up the food. We were trying to figure out what was in the on the plate tonight. We couldn't figure it out. Yeah, I don't know what it was. I think it was ground beef and potatoes or something mixed together. <laughs> it smelled like cat food. It would have been dog shit, too, for all you know. Right. I think it was cat food or something. It smelled like cat food. <laughs> I couldn't doubt it. Mm-hmm. So I just took the cookies out and bread. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm about to make another yeah. cheesecake. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, it's today or tomorrow, whatever. What time is your court tomorrow, too? I don't know. I was going to ask you if you can look it up. I think it's two. Yeah, I think it is. I was going to have my hair braided, but I don't want it to make, look, make it look like I'm too comfortable here or some shit. You know what I mean? All right. But my hair looks good right now because it's braided nicely. You want to take it out? It's going to be all curly. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm wondering if I should mm-hmm. take it out and leave it crimped like that, or if I should just, uh, after I take the shower, put some hair gel in my hair and keep it like that. Keep it down. Mm-hmm. If I use toothpaste for hair gel. <laughs> no. Yep. What's Johnny doing, or Fuzzy doing? I'm sitting here listening to you ramble. Johnny, though. Johnny, probably at work. I don't know. I don't know where he is. Tell Fuzzy to text him and tell him to message me back. Yeah. He heard you. I know he did. Took me long enough to get him to send you the first one. I know. <laughs> That's why you gotta stay on him. Fuck, man. Where's bed? This food is so much like her. Do I have a steak for supper? Uh, yeah, I think Porterhouse. That must be nice. What? I said that must be nice. <laughs> Thinking about you when I eat her. I want huh. um, Papa Murphy's chicken bacon ranch pizza. Yeah, that sounds good too. Got plans. Me and two girls from here, once we get out, we're going to take a road trip. Because there's not even a Papa Murphy's in Ohio. We have to drive all the way to Indiana. So we're going to drive mm-hmm. to Indiana, and we're going to get tattoos and Papa Murphy's pizza. No, no. Nope. Where's anyone to get tattoos? I'm bringing it back to Wisconsin with me. We're just going to keep on driving. 
but he can't stay One here. One of them is his baby mama. Mm -hmm. We'll have the baby with us. The baby can stay. Mm-hmm. That's what I said. The baby will be here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. yeah, tell Johnny to check his message. I'm trying to get him to send me eye care. His rich ass. He got money. Yeah, he ain't gonna send shit. He's stingy with his money, you know that. You know, my, the snack attack one is like less than $30. His cheap ass can send his sister a damn eye care. No. Yeah. Oh, quit being cheap. Hmm. Yeah, I need to write Al a message, actually, because I need to tell him not to buy the, net, the singles coffee. Because it's the same price. I don't get it. Mm -hmm. Didn't he get a bunch in his eye? Oh, he should get his eye care today, probably. Or tomorrow. Yeah, he probably got it for them. Not game of coffee, I think, didn't it? I don't know. Which one did you get him? The quick pack or quick pick or some shit. Yeah, that might have came up off of it. <laughs> yeah. Is Jenny gonna call you tonight? She's gonna try. Yeah, I guess she tried last. Yeah, I sent him to her. Well, so she should tell her she should write him down or something. I mean, it's a lot said. to do, but if you do it, you know. I mean, just listen to the phone. It'll, tell, it'll walk I mean, maybe she uh, just feel more comfortable messaging me instead of calling. I mean, it don't matter to me. She don't really like talking. <laughs> yeah, and I don't either. <laughs> Getting sick again. Because I'm cold. Yeah. yeah, I think she don't really like talking on the phone. Even when I called her on Facebook Messenger, she never really liked talking. She always gets phone yeah. to Jojo. Mm-hmm. Well, that flu's going around. Um... This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. For calling. Please dial 0. Plus. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presión de Dos. Thank. The current balance for your account is $31.24. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new affordable per minute rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. To block all. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello. Hello. Yeah, I need an um, extra pepperoni pizza, please. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, you're funny. I'm messing with, with, with this girl here. This pregnant lady, she's funny, so. All right, but, um... Mm -hmm. Anyways, I sent you a couple messages, one one for him, and then one for you, and then a favor for a friend, which you don't have to do, but you, you know, I just had to send it because she was right there. I mean, if you want to send it, you can, but it's up to you. I'm more worried about us than, you know. But I was calling because I sent you a message about the, the to remind you to cancel the bills and all that kind of stuff. Um, right. And, uh, I'll probably do that Wednesday when I have off again. Okay. Um, you might have to go to USPS and change the address. Um, and I think you have to put in, like, one of my... If you have my wallet, right? It's in my glove box? Yeah. Okay. You can... not. Don't use the red card. Use, like, um, the... Uh, any one of the other three credit cards you can try to see about um, putting it on there for... When you change the address, I think it charges you, like, a dollar. I think maybe the Indigo one or any of them. Just try one of them. I don't... I don't Merrick Bank one, maybe. One of them should have a dollar on it. Um, did you mm. go and get into the Key Bank one? No. Your phone was driving me nuts. I just shut it off for now. I will do that on a day, maybe next. I don't know. One of these days I can get to it. It's just been really busy the last few days, I just think. 
Okay, because, yeah, like I said, you can check the balance of it in a few days or whatever, and then whatever's on there, you can put on my books or whatever. So, that yeah. But, uh, yeah, like I said, cause that way my W-2s will hopefully get sent to your house. I know it's after January, but did Larry check my mail at all, by chance? Yeah, I got it all. Okay, well, there was no W-2s in there, was there? Um, I don't know if it was something from Walgreens, but that might have been. Oh, what is it? Because I don't know if it'd be a, che- a check or not. No, it was a big envelope. Yeah, it might be something. Oh, I don't know that because I was I was before I got in here I was um, supposed to get like a loan or whatever from them, like a gift, uh, six hundred dollars or something like that. I don't know. Hmm. You can open it and look at it or whatever, see what it is. I don't if it's a check. I don't know how. To... There ain't nothing I can do with it if it's a check. Yeah, you can you can uh hit pay to the order of Larry M. and sign my name. Say what? If it's a check, right on there, pay to the order of Larry M. and sign my name. If that if that's allowed, I don't know, but you can sign it over to Larry and have him cash it over. But I don't know. Like I said, I just had a couple things I wanted to ask you. I asked you in the message, but I wasn't sure if you got into the key bank or not. No, where is it at in there? I couldn't even find it. Yeah, I I don't think I had to download the app. I think you just have to go on the internet on there, like the Google oh. Chrome, and then go to KeyBank. And I think my password and um, username should be saved in there. So you just hit sign on and then log on. And then it KeyBank. Up. It's called KeyBank. Yeah, K E Y B A N K dot com. Alright. Yeah, and if you forget, it's on it's on my red KeyBank card in my wallet. Right. Yeah, I'm hoping that Jenny, because Jenny ordered her commissary, so I'm hoping that she will receive it. She did? Her. Yeah, did you find out if she's by herself or whatever? And nobody answers. I've been trying that number all fucking days. That's the same number I called last night, and nobody answers. So I'm going to call first thing in the morning. Yeah, because there's, there's people here 24-7, and people should be answering it. Right, and nobody answers. It just keeps ringing and ringing and ringing and ringing. Wow. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe Google it and see if you can get a different number. Or, or, I don't know. And see if you can speak, speak to the captain or the sergeant or something to find out if she's by herself or what's going on. But, yeah. Like I said, hopefully she gets her stuff. Like I said, I, they moved her. So I just want to know if she's by herself and she's all right. I'm, I'm going to try to find out some information, but right now it's a guard that doesn't like me, so I'll have to wait for the next guard. Mm-hmm. To see if, if anybody will tell me anything, so I, I try to just stay out of trouble and mind my own business. So. Right, yeah, you do. Hopefully, we can get the hell out of here. But, alright, well, I'm going to go. And I want to let you know that I have I still have 900 credits on my end of the kiosk, so don't add any money on there yet. Wait until both were as well, because if yours it says zero or, or anything, I still have some. So I can like transfer some to you. I guess it would be. Or it'll yeah, if you yeah, send me a message, it'll say that it's going to be COD, which I have to pay to open it, which is fine. So, I, I have. Well, I got like I think I got like. Well, I had three thousand on there. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's still. I still have nine hundred and something. Because for some reason it was at two fifty, and then it jumped up to nine something. Why? When I added more on there, and then I there's a button down below that every time I send a message. Yeah. I can mark that, and you you get 50 back each time. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. Yeah, because I'm at 9 feet right now, because I wasn't sure what your end said. But yeah, I got plenty right now, so. Right. Yeah. You, you send them as cool as yeah. long as you have some on your end. I got yeah. some on mine. Yeah. Alrighty. Um, did you send the, the picture of the chains? No, Fuzzy not yet. Would, Fuzzy would know if you asked him if those are chains. He knows what the chains look like. His big, his big yeah, big they, they are. But I just want to make sure they were, you know. Okay. Fuzzy so, said they're so, they're the ones he always wore. Huh? I said they're the ones he always wore with the cross okay. on it. Okay. Yeah, because I know he, he lost one, but I wasn't sure. And I know he he had the cross though, but I didn't know if that was the one. Yeah, you guys should send it. You should send a picture of it to him. He'll probably be really happy. See him again. And tell him you found him for him and all that. But. Alrighty. Alrighty. Well, 
Jenny. Well, I hope you hear from Jenny soon, or, or at least hear about her. Um, if you do message me or whatever, there's all, a lot of 12 girls in here, so it's hard to get to the phone and kiosk, but I try to get it as much as I can. But there's like a line waiting, so. All right. Okay. I love you. Love you. Let me know if you hear anything from Jenny. Okay. I'll, I'll let you know. Okay, I'll Mama. Something. All right, love you too, Fuzz. Bye. Blair said, love you. She wants to know if you want to be your baby daddy. <laughs> Look at me. Little, she's about to have a little baby girl. She's already got the kid, she said. She do when? February 2nd? Something like that. Between January 29th and February 4th. She's what, five pounds? She's going to have the baby in jail? Maybe. But, uh, but yeah, she's having a little girl. Isabella. I made her a little bracelet already. <laughs> <laughs> little armband. Little armband. Yeah, <laughs> we got to give her your number because we got armbands. We all got armbands with our inmate number on it. And I told her, she, mm -hmm. I made her armband. <laughs> but, oh, yeah. Tell Fuzzo and Larry and everybody I said thanks for coming down. But they said they're going to burn my house down. <laughs> That's how fucking bad it is. That's why I said if we get out of here, I'm going to have to stay in here until you guys physically get to the jail to pick us up if we get out, you know what I mean? Right. And, I, and that's why I want you to be able to talk to Jenny and tell her the same thing. Say, if for some reason we get out, stay in the jail, ask to be put in a med cell or um, booking or, or somewhere safe until you guys get here. Yeah. Yeah, because it's more dangerous out there for us than it is in here. Well, for me, anyway. I'll, I, I'll be fine in here, but if they let mm -hmm. her out and I'm still in here, I don't know where she would go. And especially if they burn my house down, definitely got nowhere to go. Right. Yeah. I don't think so. You don't think you want to, yeah. <laughs> All right. All right, well, I'm going to call you tomorrow or something, okay? Ron. No, okay. I love you. Love y'all. I love you. All right. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal... One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. For... Please dial 0. Hello, this is a free call from... An inmate at... Montgomery County Jail, with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. To block all future calls, press 4. <coughs> this call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Yo. What's up, hello? Nothing. Uh, you got all the hay bales? Yep. Hey, Mom, tell you that they're moving again? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You are stupid. The other person wanted yeah. to move, and she went and said I... That me and her were getting into it, you know, we weren't. I was in the damn shower, but yeah, hmm. she just wanted to get mold. I'm like, Dave, you could have picked anybody else. Like, but but that's okay because I'm fine where I'm at. I'm always on the time where I'm at. I pretty much, well. almost, I almost have my own room now. <laughs> hmm. It's like there's three. It's one big room, but then there's three rooms into that room. Does that make sense? And there's yeah. two beds in each room, and me and this girl that used to be with Jenny, actually, is in here. Me and her are uh, hmm. bunkies. We share a room. <laughs> so we got two beds hmm. in, our, in our room, a toilet, I think. That's, like, pretty much all the room there is, but then we can come out and set up tables and stuff. It's not bad. Huh. There's only six of us. Well, there's five of us right now. But there's an empty bed. So it's not bad. Hmm. The shower is much cleaner. There's no black mold. 
Uh, I actually woke up today and I could breathe. <laughs> I'm like, over there, I couldn't breathe over there. My nose was bleeding every day. And that, uh, that place over there was horrible. Mm. Yeah. But this girl that I'm with now, she's been here over a year. No, she's been here 11 months, fighting her case. So sad. Yeah. She got into a car accident and killed three people, so she's going to be here a minute. Mm. But she's a nice little young girl, so that's all that matters. Mm. Yeah. Mom's at work. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I never... Uh, I was going to call yesterday, but I'm trying to get adjusted and get unpacked. Cause when they keep moving you around, I'm there for fucking ever, so I got so much shit. <laughs> I had like four bags oh. and my, my blankets and shit. I'm like, I couldn't carry it all. <laughs> And then I had to unpack it, and now I'm on the top bunk, so I had to, like, uh, get it all adjusted. <laughs> well, I had to fucking... I was busy anyway, so... You said what? I said, well, I was busy anyway, so... It's all good to get I can't hear shit with this fan on. I hate this. But I said it was probably good you didn't fall. That I didn't fall? Yeah, yesterday. Like yesterday? Oh, fall? Yeah. I thought you said fall. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, but at least this town, their damn TV actually has sound. <laughs> Not like I really hmm. watch TV anyway, but... Yeah. No. I can sit here and call her. I gotta make Larry a Father's Day card before I forget. I gotta get that stuff out. Yeah. But yeah, um, I found out that uh, part of Jenny's deal <laughs> is that she has to um, go against me and Al, and I didn't hmm. have to do anything. So there, there's someone was telling me that um, that they were saying that her stories keep changing. They keep changing hmm. because she doesn't know what to say. She, She's going to say anything to try to go home. And that's what's fucked up. Mm -hmm. Because if she sits there and lies and says something against me, that's going to make me look bad. She needs to, to fight it and not make a deal with what she needs to do. Because we didn't do shit. You know what I mean? No. Like, they're just, they're going to roast her. She's going to end up going to prison for a long time if she keeps playing around. I'm fighting my case. I'm not, I'm not going down. I didn't do anything. I didn't, I want to go home. I'm not making a deal. Yeah. I don't. I don't want none of that. I want to go home. That's what Jenny needs to do. Y'all need to tell her to fight it and don't be jumping in no deals. Yeah. And that's the thing where she's just trying to make a deal real quick so she can go home. She's not going home. Not if she makes a deal. Part of her deal agreement is that she truthfully tells the truth and then she goes against me and L. But the thing is, is if her stories keep changing and going against me. I didn't do anything, so if she keeps telling them the truth, saying that I'm not involved, and then changing her story, and saying, making up stuff, then that doesn't make any sense. Okay. Hold on. Alright. Yeah, I don't know. What's on? Is it... I think we're doing whites right now. Of course we will. I use my damn free call. Doing what? Huh? You're doing what? I have no idea. <laughs> I think we're doing whites. Hold on. Yeah, let's see. Layers at work. There you go. You home by yourself? Pretty much, yeah. Well, I gotta let you go because I gotta get my clothes off and get changed. So I'll, I'll call you guys tonight when Mom gets home. All right. Bye.
This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID now. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Hello, this is a collect call from... An inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $32.64. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new affordable per minute rates, press 2 to accept this call. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello, did you just wake up? Yeah, I can tell you where they said the call you. Yeah, but you have to speak up because I can't hear you. You said to call you. What's up? Yeah, I just have to have hold on. You said what? You were cutting out. I said, hold on, I got to find it. All right, this your state is on there, and it's only the the 265. Okay. So did you? All right, I got two that I picked out. There's a Harry Potter books 127 special edition for 54.96, or the Harry Potter set adult edition for 72.03. This is the cheaper one. The 50 54.96. All right. And then send him the eye care, that biggie. The biggie? Yeah, that we can at least have some food and probably get the rest of the money on there. So that'll be, what, $150? I don't know. And then can you put some uh, money on uh, my boat so I can get some, a couple things, like 50 bucks or something? Uh, all right, let's see what's left. Yeah, that'll be like a hundred and... If I do the, his... Baby. You say what? Yeah, you want me to do the book, and then... Send him the biggie. His biggie, and then whatever he wants to put on your book. Yeah, so I can get some, uh, soap and stuff. Whatever I need. I'll have to do that quick, because I'm going to have to get in the shower. So I yeah, just want to make sure... Send him the biggie first, because uh, that way you can get it today. Right. All right. I'll let you. He'll still get in. It's almost 11 o'clock there. Oh, well, no. He'll probably get it tomorrow then. I think it's earlier than that. So I'll just let him know what his message is. He'll probably get it tomorrow then. So, All right. All right. I'll love you. I love you too. All right. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number followed. One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Plus... Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $3.02. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new affordable per minute rates, 
Press 2 to accept this call. Press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? Hello. How's work? Oh, boy. We only got three, $3 left on here, so... Okay, that's fine. I'll use my... Uh, I got a phone card that came with one of the package. It's got $10 on it. That'll get us some more time. Um, uh, I think Penny got one, too. Yeah, huh? I, did she ever call you? I don't know. She still has a free phone call to be able to call you. I don't know. You probably don't remember my number. I know. I had it written down, but I had it in my of contact. I have to find the right guard to see if they can give it to her. But it's hard because right now they have not a very nice one, I guess. So we all had to make our bed, make sure things okay. don't take everything away. But uh, I'm glad you got me this stuff, though, because I had to trade a couple things for a pair of socks and a pair of underwear and those girls. But they didn't have nothing. They didn't have no brush, any packages with brushes in them, I look. I know. I have to buy that. So that's what I was about to ask you. you get, if nobody messes with my vehicle, if you get down here... My wallet is in my glove box. When you come to visit, yeah. keep my credit card and put my put like a hundred dollars on my commissary. I might be able to buy and send Jenny something. I'm not sure, but because when I get out of here, I can take that with me if I get out of here. You know what I mean? Yeah. I have like probably I don't know how much I have on there, but well, probably 180 bucks or maybe even less than that. I don't know. You can put 50 on Al's if you want. Get, he can get some more things. And then put, like, 100 on mine, and I can try to get Danny something. But, uh, you do that right here at the jail on the kiosk. But, uh, you can use my credit card, my key bank red one. But the only thing I ask is when you guys go to my house, I need you to make sure you... I'm asking you this personally. On, on the dresser in my bedroom, that is Al's dresser. He's got his gold teeth. Can you please make sure that you keep them on you? Until you get to your house and put them up. Yeah, his what? His gold necklace and stuff? No, his gold teeth. Oh, his teeth. Yeah, it's, it's worth some, uh, it's a couple dollars, and it's the only thing he has that's valuable because he lost his necklaces. So, mm -hmm. I had a right. dresser for him, so I just need you to make sure you put them in your pocket or something or, or put them in the glove box anywhere, somewhere safe. You can throw them in my glove box in the Jeep, but... Who's all coming, do you know? I don't know. As far as I know, it's me, Larry, Johnny, and James, probably. Okay, because only three people can visit at one time, so somebody won't be able to come in. I don't know if Larry yeah. wants to visit or not, but... Do, do, you, do you have to talk on a phone, or do you see it personally? It's through the glass door, but it's on a phone. I have to type in my... My wristband number. That's probably uh -oh. how you figure out how to use the, the phone because you have to type in a whole bunch of numbers and then your wristband number and then you have to add your birth date. So I don't oh know. my. Yeah, it's a lot. So I'm, they're not allowed us any contact. So. Well, then she probably received all her goodies today too. Then. Yeah, she did. I saw them because she's right next door to me, and there's there's like a door that. Goes in like this kind of a hallway. I seen them give them hers first and then mine. So how many did you get? She's got three. Three, yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, the one that has my shampoo and stuff. I needed that one. I mean, it's not it's the two in one, but it, I'll have to make it work. I got deodorant and stuff, so but I need to, like I said, buy my own hairbrush and razor and stuff because my face is bad. <laughs> Yeah. You don't, you can't have razors and stuff, can you? Yeah, they have to. You have to go. You can only have it for a short period of time. But um, I was gonna say my dresser drawer in my bedroom, it's the one that's in my closet, is filled with just tons of stuff that you might want to keep. I don't know if you want to keep it in the dresser, but it's heavy. It's the top drawer is all shampoo and conditioner, all stuff for your hair. Well, we're clothes. probably ain't gonna take no dressers or anything like that. We're just gonna go get the main stuff that'll fit in a in a trailer, and that that's all we can do. How big is the trailer? Cause I, I mean, I, I, want I don't to know. We're gonna have to rent one from down there. Oh, like a big U-Haul. Well, something to pull behind the truck. I thought maybe. Huh? I thought maybe had like a cow trailer or something. <laughs> no, we don't want to pull one down. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, that's reasonable. But like I said, just um. As much stuff mine, mine as you can. Like my under my kitchen table, I have a tote that has my 
Is that purple toe? Well, ain't nobody broke in and sold anything yet. I know, that's what I'm worried about. I mean, I'm not, they're not nothing in there they can take. There's a tiny ass TV in there. <laughs> but, uh. Where's, where's Jenny's TV? Jenny's TV's in her room. But, she's got such a small room, it'll take five seconds to load her stuff up. But, like I said, my, I want the main stuff, like the, my bed and my dresser clothes, you know what I mean? You can leave JoJo's toys, and I can't do nothing with those. But I just bought his bed, that was $200. And it comes apart mm-hmm. if you need to. Like, I'm screwed or whatever. Like Allen Ranch or something. But, and, and actually, all three of our beds... Now, we're going to have to go to the police station and find out if we can go in and get this stuff. That ain't going to get caught for stealing if they're still investigating anything in your house. What do you mean? We'll find out if we can go in and there take there stuff out of there, seeing that it's... They already came into my house with the search warrant, and, and they, they, didn't, they didn't. They took whatever they needed to take. Everything else was my clothes and stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, you should be able to go in there and take out my clothes. That shouldn't be a problem. I just, you know, my clothes, my my dresser, my bed. <laughs> that has nothing to do with anything. You know, get what I can. I can't promise you. Like I said, all three of our beds. If you take them apart, like on the headboard, there's a zipper. The whole bed will fit in the headboard. So it'll just be a headboard. Because the legs come mm. off and then the, the body comes off and it all fits inside the headboard. For all of our beds. Alright. Make sure you take all my blankets, especially my pink and green one. That one's my favorite. I think it's on the couch or something. I don't know. But... And I have a little thing at the end of my bed. It holds all my blankets in it. You know, but all the Christmas presents are in my bedroom in front of Dad's shelf. So you'll see it. Just don't tell Fuzzy to peek until you know, he gets it. But you'll see, you'll be able to tell who's who's. But, yeah, I they're not wrapped yet. I didn't wrap them because they opened them all up. But I shut them again. I don't know if they went back in there again after that or not. I don't know if they went and destroyed my house after we got arrested or not. But I know for sure they they killed my dogs. Just trying not to think about it. Yeah. But you know, I'm just trying to get out of here. Like I said, I, I don't do nothing. So hopefully Monday when I have court, I can get a lawyer and try to figure out some kind of deal. I mean, the lowest I'm willing to take it is probation for something I didn't do because I can take probation out of state. So. Oh, l has got court to 26. 26. What time? Probably 3.30, that's usually what they are. 26 or 3.30? What did it say for? Or, like, what did it say? I have no idea. I'm hoping we don't run out of time here. I have that calling card. I'll, I'll call you um tomorrow or something yeah. around Christmas. What are you doing? Well, James is looking it up real quick. Yeah, because I want to know. Say hi, Fuzzy. Um, you're on uh, speaker, because otherwise I can't hear you. I still can't hardly hear you when you're on speaker. That's fine. I just not try to talk that loud, you know. It's like... Here, so. Well, they listen in on the phone calls anyway, so. Well, I, know, but I deleted Facebook and Messenger because there's too much shit going on. People are sending me nasty messages saying that I should have known that this was going on and blah, blah, blah. So they're basically blaming me and calling me a bitch and saying I should be in jail. Huh? What kind of names? What people? I have no idea. Some of them are from Ohio, some of them are from Texas. I don't know, I just deleted it. Yeah, I want to delete mine, too. 8.30 in the morning. 8.30 in the morning on Tuesday? Okay. Um, on okay. 26th, which is Thursday. Thursday, okay. Thursday at 8.30 in the morning. So, do you you work Thursday? Oh, you're going to be coming down here. What time are you guys coming down? I have no idea. I don't know if we are. We don't know for sure. we got to find out if we can get somebody lined up. So as soon as we do, I'll let you know. Okay, like I said, if Fuzzy has, I don't know if they lock the back door or not, but if he has to just break into the back door, I don't care. Just get in and get shit out. You don't even have to come visit me if you don't want to. Just just get out of this fucking city. <laughs> you know yeah. I mean? Get in, get everything, get out, and, and take it back to your house where everything is safe. I just hope they didn't fuck my vehicle up. So where's your car key? I have a spare car key in my bedroom. Fuzzy knows that there's a shelf that's behind my door. It's in that white shelf, in the white drawer. Okay. Yes, if you 
right in that white drawer. She used spare key my car, and they, they said they can, they can take the car and sell my house mm -hmm. and whatever you got to do to, to pay it. There are 60 seconds remaining. Right, well, I only have 60 seconds, so next time I'll call you, I'll call you off my calling card, okay? Night. All right, I love you. Love you, too. Right, bye. Bye. Bye, guys. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID now. <laughs> one moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Hello, this is a free call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. To accept this call, press 3 now. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello. What you doing? Um, just was filling up my cup. I want to answer it, then I lost service. Ah, uh, what do you? You said they don't have the really Raymond Deluxe. Yeah, they don't have, they don't have any Raymond Deluxe on me. Huh? They don't have any Raymond Deluxe on me. What the hell? Did they change their list or something? I don't know. Uh, well, what do they all, I mean, what terms do they have then? Because I'm looking at a, a list and it's on here. It says it's $60, 69 You know, are you looking at the, maybe you should try to call the number and see if they have it. Do you have the number? Well, yeah, I can get it, but I'm looking more into it. I'm going under your name. You said you're what? I went under your name now. I had Jenny's up there. I'll go under all gift packs and see. The afternoon delight. Back home. Don apple meat. Breakfast bonanza. Getting started. Keeping it real. Phone home. Phone home deluxe. Phone pack. Quick pack. Refresh. Snack tech. Snack showers. Sweet eat, the biggie, wake me up, that's it. Was the back home on you too? Back home, yeah, I think it's in that. So they must have took the really Raymond Deluxe off then, huh? Not so, because it's not up here. I even, like, boot or went under the search button and it wasn't on there. Well, that's dumb. So which, which other, like, one is, like, had a bunch of chips and noodles in it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to look at the list, see what you all said. I don't know what you said. Let's well, keep it real. Keeping it real. Keeping it real has 10 coffee singles, 2 raspberry drinks, 3 vanilla cappuccino, 3. I don't really like all that stuff you send me. Four ramen noodles, um, or four of the chili flavor, four of the Cajun chicken, one chicken of the sea tuna, double barrel hot dog, Colombian sauce, top part, toast and onion chips. You said what? Two Snickers and a honey, two honey buns. Mm. I don't know. I want a, I want that damn really ram to us. It pisses me off. It's dumb. Mm. I don't really want to go back. Oh, I don't want to jump high and go to the back home. That's, that's a lot. Is there one in between that at all? That has just like... Between like $50 and 
$56 as a little chip hunter. There's their bone apple meat. And oh. breakfast bonanza. Keeping it real. I might just have you send me the... Do you have the afternoon delight on there? Mm. Huh? What? Afternoon delight? That's on there? Yeah. I might just have you send me that one. Let me look at it. It's got the Cheeto. Let's see. Two, four, six, two combo, pretzel combos. Two Dorito brands. Two nacho cheese. Two of Gardettos. Two Tex Mix. Two of the Cheetos Country Jalapeno. Two of the Twist Honey. Two of the Fritos Chili and Cheese. Two of the Irish Hot Buffalo Wing Pretzel. $27.99. Two of the chili flavor ramen noodles. Two of the Cajun chicken ramen noodles. Two of the chicken flavor, another no, Cajun chicken. Two of the chicken flavor ramen noodles. Two of the Picante beef ramen noodles. Um, one cheese peanut butter and cheese crackers. And two crystal light singles. So do they take the Rock and Raymond off too, or just the Deluxe? I don't have neither one of them on there. Oh, that's stupid. Fuck. Um, I'm gonna look. I don't really want the phone home ones because I don't need the phone card. I, mean, I guess I can just call Fuzzy, but <laughs> he don't ever answer anyway. He just went home with Johnny. You said what? He just went with Johnny. Guys, you said he's with Johnny? Yeah, they just left. Yeah, they don't have either one of those ramen, the ramen ones. Right. They search. Oh, that's, that's stupid. What the fuck? I searched, I searched them and they're not on here. <clears throat> well, that's I'm going to have to ask them for a new list or something because that's crazy. Uh, I guess just from the damn... So the F one is twenty seven ninety nine and the uh next tag is twenty four ninety nine. Um I'm about trying to look at the snack attack one quick. This one, two. Ah, so it's just one I already had a bag of those. Yeah, just send the uh fucking Damn. Then I threw the light one, I guess. I always think about it and then just send me a message. Yeah, I'm going to look over it and then fucking message you to let you know if you know. Alright. Alright, bye. Yep, love it too. Bye. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. Please enter your personal ID number followed by... One moment. One moment. For collect call, press 1. Please dial 0. Press. Hello, this is a collect call from an inmate at Montgomery County Jail with telephone service provided by Paytel Communications. Para Español Presione 2. The current balance for your account is $47.47. Stay on the phone after this call for payment options. To receive information about new, affordable permitted rates, press 2. To accept this call, press 3. This call will be recorded and subject to monitoring at any time. You may begin speaking now. Hello? Hello? What you doing? Eating Hello? pizza. 
eating pizza for breakfast? What's wrong with you? And having a soda. And having a soda? You don't drink soda. What's going on? I don't know. What kind of soda are you drinking? Orange. Orange. Oh, that don't count as soda. (laughs) (laughs) Pizza and soda for breakfast. Didn't your mother teach you nothing? Nope. Uh, you know, I want some damn pizza and soda. I don't even drink soda. I want a soda. It's Pizza Hut pizza. Oh, Pizza Hut at that. You didn't have to tell me all that. <laughs> I had two pieces, uh, one piece of meat lovers and two pieces of chicken bacon. Don't say taco. No, I didn't get taco. Okay, that's my favorite. Mm-mm-mm. I love taco. No, no. We sat in the fridge since Wednesday, so I figured I better eat some of it first. What I'm about to eat when I get out this motherfucker is we going to Papa Murphy's. I want that chicken bacon ranch pizza. I just had chicken bacon ranch. From from Papa Murphy's? No, pizza. No, <laughs> no we're going to Papa Murphy's. We're going to get that chicken bacon ranch. And, that's what I want. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's so hot in this motherfucking place. Have <laughs> you talked to Jenny lately? Not today. Yeah. I was telling the girl, I said, if the phone was ringing, I said, damn, I gotta take a shit again. Every time I call you, I gotta take a shit. And I just took a shit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure I'll be yeah, soon. I just ate. When you're driving home and you gotta pee, and the closer you get to home, you gotta pee even more. It's like that. Every time I call you. <laughs> yeah. Plus, I dropped my cup of coffee this morning, so. My lawyer still ain't messaged me back. He ain't come to see me. He messaged me on Monday talking about he emailed him. When he hears back, he's going to come see me. It's Friday, and I still ain't seen him. And then I put in to go to the doctor on the 17th. I ain't, they still ain't took me. And then I asked the nurse last night, I said, look, I don't put it in to go to the doctor. What's going on? She was just like, oh, well, it's not in here. Put it in again. So I put it in last night. Me and this other girl put it in at the same time. She put it in right after me. They're going to call her this morning for the school to the doctor, but not me. I'm like, this is ridiculous. I'm about to start right now. Average all the way that they treat me here. They keep treating me like this. I'm going to sue their fucking ass. They need to start treating me like a normal person. I'm proud of this. Yeah. But I got this <clears throat> one girl. Hopefully she gets up today. I'm hoping. She about to go down to the damn downtown here in front of the jail and start protesting about my name. And getting me the fuck <laughs> out of here. There. Yeah. You know, all it takes is one person. She can go out there and, and she she used to work where I worked at, so you know it's just, it's just a small ass city. Everybody know everybody, so I don't know yeah, as long as, long as nobody hurts there for doing that. Oh no, ain't nobody gonna do all that. She she gonna go out there and protest and then who's gonna be showing up. Yup, that's all I need. She gonna put free Amanda and and two sides to her story. Yup, I got I got motherfuckers out here hearing my story. They need everybody need to hear it. Shit ain't right. Been here five months and for for nothing. Get me the I fuck know. out of here. All I did was go to work. That's all I want to do. <laughs> that's why I, I said keep that money on my card because if, if we get another stimulus check, I'm gonna use that money. I'm gonna hire me a lawyer to get Josiah back. Oh, once I get up out of here, I'm hiring me a lawyer. I'm going to get my son back. Yep. I don't care. I'm going to pay a damn lawyer for that. <laughs> Let me fuck up. Getting up uh, up here, I'm going to get my son back. And I think it cost, what, $3,500 for a lawyer last time? I'll pay the $3,500 for a lawyer this time. I just want my son. I don't know. Uh, you gotta work twelve to eight today. Yeah. You like those hours? You what? Did you like those hours? It ain't too bad. I just don't like the nine o'clock, until nine o'clock shift because then we don't get out of there till almost ten. It's dark and I don't like driving in the dark. Oh, what time do they close? Ten. On normal days, nine, but we'd probably mop and clean up and before we get out of there. Oh, yeah. 
Why the fuck? Yep. So I don't know. Hopefully I hear from, hopefully my lawyer comes see me today. I don't know. Yeah. You know. Hey. Hopefully. I'm tired of waiting. Now I'm being in this fucking place. I wanna know what the fuck's going on. I'll never know what's going on. Hopefully that girl gets out today and trying to have somebody out there protesting for me. <laughs> Oh, shit. I don't know. I'll let you go. Um, like I say, can, tonight or whenever you get time, can you send Stephanie that I care that we eat for? Yeah. Okay. Um, Alrighty, I'll let you go. Eat your pizza. I'm done with it. Uh, smoke a cigarette for me. I'm about ready to do that. <laughs> All right. I'll, I'll talk to you later. I'll mess you on the or whatever, so. All right. Now, next weekend, the 29th and 30th, we're going to be camping in Door County, so I don't know if you just want to not call that weekend. Half right. the time, I won't have my phone on me, probably. Or I'll just message you or something. You can check it every now and again. Uh, if we internet there, I don't know. But two days won't hurt you. I'll be back on Sunday. Okay. You can call me Friday morning because we're not, well, it had to be early because we're probably going to leave here by 10, Friday morning. All right. Well, so as soon as they turn the phones on, if I'm up, I will. Good night. All right. Don't forget to send it out of here then. I love that. Okay. Yeah, otherwise it takes a couple hours to get there. So, I mean, you can call while we're on the road too. So just, I won't have you on speaker because Larry will be in there and James, but um, we can talk, whatever. Okay. Alright. Alrighty. I'll let you. I'll message you for hearing things from my lawyer or anything. So. Alright. I'll check it while I'm at work. Okay. Alright. I'll let you. I'll let you too. Yeah. Bye.